Hello everybody and good day. It is Iron Man, countdown, end of the world, day two, whatever we're calling this one. I'm probably on the main channel just going to name it something like Skyrim, but I only have 30 days. I did something similar on the first VOD, but I don't want the titles to like be the same. I've done that before where I've taken like the title and used it on a VOD and been like, oh crap, I can't use it twice. Why do I have my phone on? Why is my phone alerting me to my own stream starting? Strange. Airplane mode. Full focus. We're hanging out. W streamer. W chatter. Let's not be a W slash L. Uh, eh, maybe. Maybe we've already come too far. I actually have a game plan today, though. So. Y yesterday was bad. Y yesterday I had. Thank you, Karn, sir. Hello. Ooh. Uh-oh. One sec. Okay, there we go. That's fixed. I accidentally had the recording going on the stream scene, so I heard the alert like twice. Uh, Glorious Havoc, I appreciate you. Thank you for two months. Is it a Bleak Falls Barrel Thane of White Run Angle? No, it's... It is an immediately acquire as much... You, Here, here's something we did wrong yesterday. I was collecting all of this iron ore yesterday, but I was smithing it. I was turning it into iron bars. Waste of time. I have to go get transmute. We have to immediately save all of our iron ore and transmute into gold. Uh, we made one change to the rules, which is every time we die, we're going to lose five hours. So retroactively, we've lost 20 hours. I got hours. my supervisor at work into watching your streams. Your supervisor's watching? Supervisor, if you can hear me, I need you to promote Mr. Feather. You know Mr. Feather comes into these streams Thank all the time, concept. and they're constantly saying in chat, they're going, hey, what just happened? I missed it. I, was, I, had my, I had my head down. I was working away. Yeah, I was focused on the department and its goals. I was focused on KPIs. That's key performance indicators for those of you who are not familiar with corporate lingo. Mr. Feather is always in chat, constantly thinking, like, wait, I, I missed the last 45 minutes. Can somebody summarize? I, I was in a meeting, and, and I had to, you know, run the show. I also wanted to make sure that I heard all of my other employees and stakeholders so that they could be heard and I could better understand what I needed to deliver them. They're always talking about that. So, Mr. Feather's supervisor, I think you need to come on. That promotion is long overdue. You're trying to no, I'm, I'm not trying hard at all. I'm not even this is just this is just corporate lingo coming out. Worth every septum. I appreciate the good words, but I'm unironically delivering my two weeks notice via your stream. <sighs> well, that's awkward. Uh, to Mr. Feather's new employer. I hope you know that they are constantly in chat, always distracted. <laughs> they're always, they're, they're always, you know, distracted by work and can never pay attention. So I, I hope you know that you're getting a good worker. Mr. Feather, I appreciate it, though. Thank you. Lots of spaghetti. Thank you for 16 months. Quinny of the Green, thank you for half a year. Six whole entire months. Appreciate it. I need to, uh, I... Was doing something weird yesterday that uh, maybe I was like recording just a goofy, dumb thing. So I have to switch the audio that is actually getting recorded back over to. Thank you, kind sir. Scrim. Going Let's to give me two seconds on the new VOD upload, but hope you're having a great Saturday. No problem, Nerdin. We will see you when we see you. Have a good one. Thank you very much for 11 months. Thank you, Karn, sir. No way. It's been just a short while since Stoog Dug originally raided you. That was a while ago. That was, a. Uh, weren't we doing without leaving New Vegas at the time? I think that's when we got it on tape that Doug has never played New Vegas. Definitive proof. Thank you, Karn, Wild. sir. Juve, heart, can't wait to see the VODs for these runs. You Kron guy, I appreciate it. Thank you. Can you scream really loud? No. No, 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 no. No, 
I don't live in an apartment, but I do have one shared wall. Thank you, kind sir. Dwarf seller, thank you for four months. Also, NP sub, thank you for 18 months, whole year and a half. That is wild. I'm a god. How can you kill a god? Ooh. What a grand and intoxicating. Hold on, hold on. The Skyrim theme I'm song is playing in my ears How too right now. That was a strange crossover. Thank you, uh, Redundant T, thank you for gifting Fish five to the channel. And you've playing Skyrim equals perfect Saturday night. Thank you, kind sir. Three months, yay. Stayed the night in a sketchy hotel last night and was really paranoid, so he put on one of your VODs. <laughs> well, I don't know. What if somebody was walking by that was really sketchy and they weren't a fan? And what if they looked in the wind and they were like, I can't believe they're watching that guy. Now I know who I'm robbing tonight. Have I ever played Immortal Phoenix Rising? I haven't. All right, let's get started in two seconds here. Uh, Sugar Ray, thank you for three months. Blue, 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 but thank you for the tier two at seven months. Appreciate you. Fish and chips. And Juve playing Skyrim equals perfect Saturday night. Time, sir. Am I a fish? Uh, uh, you know what? Uh, this is, uh, this is I, I feel ashamed of this. You know the one time I've ever had fish and chips? Hopefully my microphone didn't pick up that disgusting glugging, but... One time I ever had fish and chips. I was going to meet my friends in Denver. It was for, uh, this was uh, just this past summer. And it was for a bachelor party. I was a late arrival. I got there at like 8 p.m. And the thing with being the late arrival at a bachelor party, you're kind of like the energy guy, you know? If everybody hit it a little bit hard earlier in the day, maybe they're a little bit sluggish. Maybe they have imbibed a little bit too much. So having the energy guy show up, it's like, all right, all right. I was like so excited to be there. I was so pumped to be there. I haven't seen, you know, some of these guys in so long. And I see them and everybody was moving at like two miles an hour. They were all hammered. <laughs> they all spent the whole day just going after it really hard. But when my plane landed, I was texting my buddy at the time and they were actually at this fish and chips place right across the street. I know fish and chips place in America. Get your jokes out now. It was right across the street from the Airbnb we were staying at. And so when I was in the Uber on the way, I had like a half hour. So I was like, ooh, get me something, you know, just so that when I get there, I can have a quick bite to eat. When I got there, not only was everybody moving at like two miles an hour because they partied too hard throughout the whole day that I missed. They put the fish and chips in the fridge. So the fish was cold and the fries were cold. And that's... I was so upset. It was not good. It was gross. Did I get a haircut a couple days ago? I might go in fairly soon. It's not. I have a bad time understanding what I want out of a haircut, but I think I figured it out. I got this damn widow's peak. It's too low. I need it to be. I need it to be brought up a little bit. I know, I could have put it in the oven to reheat it, but we were short on supplies. We didn't even have ice cubes. That's a Thank whole different you, story. Sir. Just do what I do. Number one, shave all the way around. Uh, mm, I don't know if I want to go with a full shave. I don't know about that. Yeah, no, Sonny, I... I I think I disabled kill cams like intentionally. They might not show up for the arrows anymore, but they were showing up far too much during melee combat, so we got rid of them. Although they still show up sometimes when we shoot arrows. What's come dine with me? Get a bowl cut? Should I get ye old fryer?
Oh wait, this is not a bowl cut. This is like uh this is like a balding bowl cut. This. God, God man, Google's image search is so bad anymore. You know, it's always just like a link to a much worse version of the picture. Like, like this. Like, like this cut. You think I can pull that off? Doubtful. All right, no more screwing around. Let's do this. Uh, we change one rule. Every death is minus five hours as well as it's been. So we're down 20 hours. We're going to pick up exactly where we left off yesterday. The goal today is going to be to do uh, a bunch of smithing grinding and then really get into the Dark Brotherhood quest line. General Tullius cut. Uh, JT, thank you for the tier one, by the way. So in order to account for the extra 20 hours, I'm just going to wait for 20 hours. Eh, that's going to hurt. That's going to hurt, because now I already got to sleep. And I have to put the day forward one. Uh, I guess I don't have to sleep too much. It's still somewhat clear outside. 7 p.m. So we have some time. Let's do a little bit of hunting. We want to hunt. We want to collect a shitload of iron. We want to get transmute. We want to make gold jewelry. Those are the top things we want to focus on right now. We have a party of six watching in Norway. Party of six? What's going on, party? How we doing? <laughs> That's a lot of pressure. Let me check this kill cam mod real quick. Those kill moves are on for melee. Ranged on archery. Match kill moves triggered by you and NPCs will match corresponding weapon types. Mainly kill moves off. Okay, I need my ranged kill cams back. Just make sure we save so it's locked in. Ooh. Perfect timing. One for one. Oh, no, no, I think I overshot it. How? I could have sworn that was money. Is that a bear? What is that? No, it's a cow. I don't want to accidentally shoot the giant's cow. Two down. And a Corinna Marvel. Hot start. Hot start. Are you guys you guys can't gamble on arrows that like, that's too quickly. It's gonna happen too quick. Kenny, you're getting out of hand. Oh, 
Thank you, kind sir. I think I've already lost where the... Oh, crap. Where were the elk at? Also need to keep our eyes peeled for butterflies. Blue mountain flower butterflies. Although I have his healing spell. I did finally buy one. Shit, so much harder at night though. Do you think I could sneak in and just get transmute? Ah, ah, ah. Oh, good. Crisis averted. Oh, let's get that. Gotta get that saber cat pelt. Don't hurt me. It's all good. We're friendly. too dark out first time here venom mage venom mage venom 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 mage i don't know how to pronounce that i'm struggling with it but good to see you do i need nern root i don't need it do i Nighttime. Why you gotta be so dark? Oh, 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 oh. That's what I'm talking about. We need the corundum. I want steel arrows. Uh, if we're not doing heavy armor, I don't think we need very much steel. I don't know what the recipe is, though, for elven. Does anybody know what the core ingredient for elven is? Is it just steel? Would you ever do anything with the Legacy of the Dragonborn mod? That's a good question. I haven't played it a ton. I have it on my Xbox save file. Um, and I know it could be really cool. Come on, come on. That's not even close. <laughs> I sailed right past him. Come on, give it to me. Right up the ass. Boom! That is the most lethal and fast enema you could ever deliver. I wonder if we can, oh, is there a bed at this camp? We have to make up for the 20 hours that we lost. So like a real hunter, we got to get up bright and early. 4.30. I feel like hunters and dads who need to get their family all into one plane kind of have this intersect. Or like hunters got to be up early, you know, for the morning hunt. But dads who have a family they're trying to coordinate on a flight, they have to be up really, really early just for nonsense dad reasons. No, nothing. Wish there was a bedroll or something there. If I had that one spell, do you guys remember from the Chaos Mage Fabricate Object? That spell would be kind of nice. It's really expensive, though. Oh, I asked, I asked the question and I totally missed it if anybody answered it. Is 
No, it wouldn't be Steel. What's what's Merrick? I'm already forgetting the name. Is it Elven Armor? Yeah, what's Elven Armor? That's Merrick, right? Moonstone. Oh, how the fuck do I get Moonstone? Is that going to be in the Reach? No, no, you can't. You can't just put up invisible walls. Okay, whoever this JK is that made this mod, I'm going to need you to reverse that invisible wall. Okay, you're taking away my shortcuts. The more efficient I am, the more immersed I am. So, you know, my immersion is being broken right now. All right, that's still not a little, that's not a bad shortcut right there. That's what I was thinking. It, when we get to 10 points, I think unlocking a vendor, or not a vendor, I think unlocking a blacksmith vendor is gonna be our best play. We won't be able to abuse them, but we will be able to at least get some of the stuff that we wanna get. Did I help? You did indeed, Sunny. Sunny. Let's see if Moonstone is in here. Refined Moonstone to Moonstone Ore. Yeah, we'd have to find Moonstone Ore. Oh, Christ. Saints and Seducers? That's a big departure, though. In white one is terrible. I enjoy this Shame. work well enough. Sure thing, it's yours. I'll show you to your room right this way. Need anything else? All right, let's sleep. We'll go. Yeah, I want to be up at four ish a.m. It's amazing. You can be up for <laughs> month morning start. The dead of winter. Yeah. So is it going to be incredibly cold outside? That could be a problem. Need to talk to Holder real quick. Why, John Battleborn, you writing me a song? Where's she? Where'd she go? Oh, she went up to the room. I was all confused. Where the hell did you go, Holder? Here, take a look at this. Some of the Yarl's men came by and left this bounty. Bounty Valheim Towers. Okay. All right, that's close. It's not even sunny out. Could sure use a bed. Time out. We gotta save ourselves some time. We're gonna make a couple campfire sets, take them with us. Our mini goal right now, yeah, is to grind out smithing a little bit. Then kick into the Dark Brotherhood quest line. I think overall goals in terms of quest lines I want to complete, Dark Brotherhood and Dawn Guard. As weird as that might sound. I've just never covered them on the channel, and I think if we have the opportunity to, it'd be really fun to try and race through them. Oh, fuck, overnumbered, come on. Did I craft this backpack? I think I did. Forgot to put it on, though. I had to drop one, but then I crafted another. Three firewood. Three firewood, one leather. Let's make two. That's a lot of weight, though. We can cut out some weight. Uh, don't want to use all my corundum. I don't even know if I want to make Corundum ore. Or Corundum ingots. I think we want to save it for steel. Are you going to be on the vampire or dawn guard side? I... 
probably Dawn Guard. I think the Dawn Guard armor is so cool. I, I won't be able to wear it unless I can craft it, but I just think they look cool. Oh, rain. Oh, joy. Somebody let me know that there's a couple console commands I could enter that would lower the chances of rain with Obsidian Weathers. I did enter those. So the chance of rain is cut by like one, by like two thirds. I'm gonna go for transmute. How many arrows we got? 30? Not a stealth archer. Don't I don't wanna hear it. That's uh, just not nearly enough damage. That is total nonsense that they can see me. Bad idea. Wait a minute. Maybe not a bad idea. Do I have my bear traps? Yes, all right, we got a bear trap. Let's take this one warrior. Easy, I'm almost out of stam. Good thing we made some potions. I gotta get somewhere where the bear trap is easier to see. This is not too bad. Got a hit. I can't believe I'm actually using the freaking bear trap. Didn't hit. No arrows. Ah, they're still shooting arrows at me. We gotta move. That one landed really close by. I gotta get my bear trap back, though. Bob and weave. I see one of them. It's just the archer. Okay. Push the archer. Normal strategy. Forward, move. Forward, dodge. Forward, dodge. Forward, dodge. Bit easier with the sword than it is hand to hand. No loot. Ah, that's a mage. Shit. I'm gonna have to leave the bear trap behind. Thank you, time, sir. <clears throat> Major's like my one weakness. So is cold weather. They're getting close. Hopefully we can confuse them going up this hill here. Yeah, they're gonna have to go around. This is the dumbest way I've ever cleared out a bandit hideout. I gotta play it safe though. Thank you, kind sir. All right, everyone, group howler, woe and woo. Thank you, Lily. Thank you for 22 months. That's bullshit. Now that's rigged. All right, the White Run guards are locked in. Thank you, officer. 
Thank you for protecting Whiterun. At ease. Thank you, kind sir. Telekinesis to pick up and throw the bear traps? I don't know. I feel like that would get a little bit unpredictable. I mean, it'd be fun. But I do kind of like having them static. They're easy to predict where they go. Ooh, is this guy running away now? Another archer. Stumble. Booyah. Sweating my way through a three bandit encounter. That might be a perk, Yanni Schwings. Immobilizing them. I loves you. Thank you very much for the eight months. Skyrim Rain Audio massages the brain meat. Yeah, well, you know what it does for me? It makes it harder to edit around and harder to think. <gasps> Garlic. I'm going to be honest, we might do Salmon Row Nordic Barnacle. Garlic. We might. All right, now don't get your hopes up. Anybody out there who wants to see meta crafting? Gold jewelry may be as far as we go. But maybe we go the ultimate potion training route. I don't know where I put my bear trap. Forget the bear trap. I can make another one. They're cheap. Is that everyone outside? They're going to have some salt here for sure. <gasps> How dare you not have salt? Thank you. Thank you. That's what I thought. But take the cabbage so we can make soup with it. First kill shouldn't be too bad. It's just a rocky kill. Or it's a mostly rocky kill. Let's soften him up, though. Oh, this one's tough. Come on, Rocky, do your thing. Do your thing, buddy. <gasps> oh my god. He's cracked the code. You won't get the best of me. Come on, Rocky, please. Ah, oh, he keeps he keeps pulling up his shield. We got healing potions. We're alright, I think. All right, I'll stand right here. There's like four Rocky right in front of him. You got to do some damage. <laughs> All right, there you go. See, it, it just took him a few seconds. Thank you, kind sir. Close to birth now. Oh, I can't drop keys. That's a bummer. 
Oh, wait a minute. <gasps> Free bear trap. Ozback, thank you for the prime. What are you gonna name the Twitch baby I'll end up abandoning? You can try and come up with some creative names like Forever Alone. Uh, no pops. Alright, we're gonna have to reset and line up Rocky again to be in a more deadly formation. But if we can combine the bear trap with Rocky and the bear trap hits, we also have the fire pot in the next room. We have a lot of oil on the ground. That could do some damage. We wanna stagger these. I might not be able to move that last one. We only get three? That's not good. I think we want to go with the bear trap right here. So that it's at least guaranteed to activate. Don't ever do that again. Oh crap, wait, hold on. I have to go through the door first. So we need a little bit of leeway. I have to be able to avoid it. I don't want to take myself out. Just in case this goes south, I don't want to lose a bunch of progress. Let's see if we can throw an arrow out that just distracts them and they land on the oil. Too far. I don't know how to tell you this, but the baby is not yours. Definitely got a hit there. They're pushing. Somebody went down. We definitely got a kill with it. Mage? Oh, Why is it always got to be a mage? <gasps> they moved on. Good, good, good. At least one of them's dead. We have a shot here. Let's see if we can get it. Stop moving. Missed. Thank you, kind sir. Ah, they got me. Yes, the mage went down. All right, mage is down. It's just a bandit chief. We got to fall back outside. Please don't be right behind me. I'm a god. How can you kill a god? Not the time to be dancing. It's time for serious gameplay. Jared, I appreciate that. Thank you for the tier one. How are you? Thank you very much. Hear me out. If the bandit chief is going to be closer to the entrance. Where is the exit? The little trap hole. We could go in the back door. No way it's all the way up here. Wouldn't match the topology. It's right there. I just have to avoid the spikes when I jump into this pit. <laughs> Please. Just don't, just don't do the dumb thing. Do the smart thing. Nice and easy.
Did I just see someone moving right there? No, that trap triggered. Mine? Alright, so they just reset and went back to their normal spot. Why am I slow? Move up the hallway right here. Come on, hit. Ooh. How? Nice, got a hit. Come on, Rocky, finish the job. Finish him, Rocky! Ah, oh, you almost had it. You inanimate prick. Don't follow me. Don't you dare follow me out here. We almost got him. All right. Let's take him through the loop one more time, and we got him, <laughs> and then he's dead. Not cool by Rocky to not perform there when I needed him to. I mean, he got one hit in, but I'm going to need more from him. Oh, we actually beat him back here. Uh-oh. I'm dead. I'm not dead. I think that bear trap fell through the ground. Please hit. Yeah! Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. I am the master of deception. See, this is why I'm getting into the Dark Brotherhood first try. That was so stupid. I, 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 how many times did I even swing my sword? Once? Twice? Maybe? I'm starting to learn that I feel like that's the only way when you're really underpowered to defeat really tough enemies in Skyrim is to just use environmental banana peels. I need a button on this stream deck that I hit and whenever I hit it, it just plays Looney Tunes ass sound effects. Whoop, 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 whoop. Did you ever learn the cadence of on the road again? On the road again. Thank you, kind sir. I just can't wait to be on the road again. Thing I love is making music with my friends. And I can't wait to be on the road again. Something like that. Pretty close. How is it you learn magic? We can buy. Uh, we can buy spells. That was the one vendor item that we switched that is kind of universal we can engage with. We can buy spells. However, if you look at my bank account, I don't think we're going to be doing that a whole lot. Thank you, kind sir. Do you play any musical instrument? Uh, yeah, I can play guitar. I started playing when I was like 14. I have not played in a while, but I played it long enough between like 14 and 21 to where if I pick it up, then I can like, if, if I picked it up and you were like, can you play this song? It's a G and then it's a C and then it's a D and then it's an F and I'll be like, okay, yeah, I can play that. But can I shred? No. No, 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 no. Nothing, nothing super technical like that. Salt, salt, must have salt, must need, need it. I know, oh yeah, I got my salt. Love it, I love it, I fucking love salt. I want a mod that adds MSG <laughs> instead. You can have salt piles and MSG piles. MSG, it doubles the uh, effect from your food. Oh, poacher's axe, that's fun. 
I missed an ore on the floor? I don't think so. I've actually never cooked with MSG. I just know it's like superpowers. At least that's what binging with Babish taught me. And that's a YouTuber who talks just with their hands. How can I? <laughs> they can't be wrong. They're a torso tuber. Is that an actual thing? Like there's, you know, I saw, uh, <laughs> I mean, take it with a grain of salt pile. This is just something on Twitter, but I saw somebody, uh, like, you know how there's VTubers, right? And there is a distinction for the type of streamer slash creator that is, right? They are a virtual tuber, VTuber. But then I saw somebody refer to non VTubers as flesh tubers. <laughs> I, I think I think that's what I, I want to call myself from now on flesh tuber. But if you've ever seen Binge with Babish, they record all the videos like from like the bottom, like the top of their neck to the bottom of their torso. Is that a torso tuber? I mean, what would that be? Come on, Sack. Sack, you have disappointed me. Transmute. Give me that. We have to make sure that we get our transmuting done before we die, spin the wheel, and lose that spell. That's what's going to happen. I'm going to die and lose transmute ore. Can I even cast it? 88. Oh, you know what? We, we can't. There's one problem. I have to manually wait for my Magicka to come back. I can spend my Magicka potions. But I can't wait in game to force the grind. Because waiting in game, we just lose time that way. It's going to be a little bit. Okay, I don't like that I'm mining while inside of a killable, you, a killing shot. object. Can we not do this? Can we, can we mine in a less dangerous fashion? Not even going to chance it. I hate this game. I hate this game. Who made your flesh tuber skin? I can't tell you. If I do, then the secret's out. Also, I don't know if you all noticed, but me wearing this sweater, it's kind of like if you play Fortnite and you have that season one blue knight skin. This is like a legendary throwback skin from the very first season one battle pass. Maybe season two. JRC Roller, thank you very much for the tier one. Blood Phoenix, I appreciate you. Thank you for the prime. Pally Denaya, thank you for the prime. Jared, thank you again for gifting five subs. That was very kind of you. And thank you as well for the tier one. We need the big sweater back. I was wearing that this morning. So... Something that usually happens in our family every Christmas is everyone will get one of like the same thing. And this year it was these big oversized sweaters, which fuck yeah. Oh man, getting cozy with a sweater, a rainstorm outside. Nothing like it. Uh, but this morning I was in the kitchen, I'm making breakfast. And my sister got home from, she was at the gym. She comes in through the door and she's wearing the exact same sweater. And we just had this moment where we just kind of paused and stared at each other like, <laughs> what's up? Let's 
get transmute favorited. Oh, it is. Silly me. So I think we go through maybe two, I think spending two days in game will be enough time for us to grind a shitload of our, uh, of our smithing. If we focus on killing elk, hunting, getting leather, why is it still raining? We got a good amount of gold there. 367. Do I have my bear traps? Yeah, I got one. I really wish this granted more illusion XP. Alteration. Uh, the mod for running, it's not, it, it's an overall first person animation mod. It's comprehensive first person animation overhaul. The mod that I, and then I combine that with Immersive Sound Compendium. They work great together. The actual mod for magic I have is Apocalypse. That's the one that adds in all the different magic spells. I'm just going to comb this area. Keep an eye out for iron ore veins. Looks like there's one right here. There's a lot of iron ore veins in Bleak Falls Barrow, right? Might not be a bad idea to do Bleak Falls. <clears throat> it's gonna be fairly tough though. BFB? Oh, this is straight silver ore, hell yeah. I don't think there's actually adult content in the mod list. This is my first stream and I am here to steal your W Riz. Put your hands up, L Bozo. Like, I'm not gonna ban you. <laughs> no, 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 we can't. I refuse to allow this to become one of those streams. What if it did? What if I came in here with the shaved sides of head, perm, middle of my head haircut, and the entire stream was constantly just about W or L Riz. Now we'd still be playing Skyrim, but <laughs> that wouldn't change. Who has the most W Riz in all of Skyrim? In all of the Elder Scrolls? I'm begging you, please no. Why would I do that? Other than ironically. Other than poking fun at a sector of the internet.
We have an entire playthrough on the channel where the whole concept of it is just to shit on, like, douchey podcasts. I think it was, a, uh, I think it was Jay Waller. That was my guy. That was my YouTube shorts guy that I was always getting in the feed. He'd always have some, like, fake deep shit. There's one where he's like, uh, <laughs> my, I think I talked about this one before. My favorite alpha bro YouTube short I got. It was this guy who's like, you know, I hear from clients or I tell my, I tell my students all the time how important sleep is. You know, every single day I make sure to sleep. It's, it's really important. You gotta, you know, <laughs> it's like the actual point he was making is just go to bed once a day. Once a day, you gotta go to sleep. Okay. This is life changing shit. Hold on, 11 arrows. You prefer every other day? So, do you double up your sleep on the day after you haven't slept? Let's hit this. Ah, man. I'm gonna end up firing into a crowd of Khajiit. That's f <laughs> fuck you. I thought I was about to hit the coolest shot ever. I actually thought that one was hitting. It wasn't even close. It was an entire wall. A J wall. All right, relax, buddy. You're in civilized. He's going up to the guard tower. I'm not risking assault just for a kill here. Let's favorite transmute. Let's just throw transmute on one, bow on two, sword on three. Have we already lost seven days? Oh, wow, yeah. We're a weekend. We only got one point. However, we have three quests that will count as just one for three points that we can turn into the Dark Brotherhood. I need to cut down on weight, though. Making our gold bars will do that. 44 iron ore. Look at that XP. Gold diamond ring. <gasps> Wait a minute. We also want to do silver. I remember this from last time. Silver. I have six garnet. Right? So we want to get six silver ingots. We can't skimp out on silver jewelry. It's it's not all about gold. So I think what I have to do is go like this. Gold ore. Wait, do I not have silver ore? I remember this from last time. I have to drop whatever silver ore that I have. So that I get another one. Right? Rinse, repeat. Keep doing that. I know it's it's annoying to do silver, but if we really do want to optimize our smithing, which I do want to do, you know, I want to try and complete and get as many points as possible. We're going to have to.
Fun. Why is silver better than gold? So there's certain silver jewelry recipes that will take the excess jewels that we have, like garnets, um, ruby. Gold will only take the highest level ones. Amethyst, I think we can do with silver. Gold only takes things like diamonds, sapphire. It takes the much more expensive and rare gems for their jewelry. And the way XP is given for crafting in Skyrim, it all comes down to... One sec. It all comes down to how expensive the item you're making is. So that necklace we just made was worth 900. So we got almost an entire level and then some of smithing XP. If I collect silver, see where I'm going with this? Subscribe for more tips. Like here, I'll show you right now. We go in here, we go silver ring it. Make two of those. Come back here. And now we can make a silver ruby ring worth 260. Boom. That took us to level 24. We can get a silver amethyst ring worth 180. I'm going to be able to make nine of those. That's almost a half a level of XP. hit this place do I not have I don't have any restore I was hoping we can make more restore magic anybody with extensive magic knowledge in Skyrim know which one of these might be restore magic I offer remedies for ailments both common and rare do let me know if I can be of service I know which one's purple goes with but the basic purple, red, blue, those don't offer very much in terms of XP. Are you allowing exploits in general? Not too many. You'll find tonics, salves, poultices, and potions on my shelves. Browse to your heart's content. What if I sneak? That could come in handy, so I'll keep it. You have ADD? None of your business. Have you met my father? Nope. He's a steward. Wait, maybe. How do you do the point system? What, like above my head? They're just text files that when I hit a button on my stream deck, they update. All right, two more silver ingots. Of course, it's not raining. Now that I'm not out adventuring anymore, the rain stops. 25. You tried mercenary work? This sucks. Oh, wait, I could wait until we have yeah we could save up our jewelry until we actually get a vendor thank you kind sir oh Me no and you my can't. wife are trying to figure out where to get lunch and ice cream where should we go taco bell <laughs> go to you know what knock out two two birds with one stone hit the uh, dairy queen grill and chill Nah, there's got to be a better way. The 
there's not going to be very much more Tapanella on my way to Riverwood. Hey, does anybody know where we could find a good concentration of just silver ore? Silver ore veins. That might speed this up just a little bit. Markarth, Karth Weston. Center Arch Mine. We don't want gold right now. We want silver. I don't know if you can mine in Sydney. All right, let me pull up my handy dandy interactive map of silver ore. Thank you, kind sir. No, not quicksilver ore. Silver ore veins. Silver, 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 silver. This, yeah, 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 mm-hmm. Damn, this area of the map is really tough, though. Like, what, am I going to go up here and fight all the Forsworn? No, I get my ass kicked. Seven veins and Santa Arch Mine inside of Karth Waston. Karth Waston. Which one's Karth Waston again? Oh, wait, Karth Waston's just a town. And it's pretty close to Markarth. It's going to have some of our crafting stuff. I know where we're heading next. Off to Karth Waston. Nazim, go back home. Nobody, no, no, everyone knows you don't have shit to do outside of town. Go home. Loser. Oh, by the way, if you are on the Discord server, we added a channel on there uh, yesterday, I believe. Maybe the day before. But uh, if you have like tunes from classic video games and whatnot that you want to recommend for the stream or for videos in general, you can do so there. I don't remember what the name of the channel is. Apologies, but it's there. What even is Nazim's fake job? His dad probably handed him down like eight billion dollars. Something goofy like that. Now, he pretends to own a farm. That's what it is. <clears throat> His dad owns a used car dealership. Okay, on our way to Karth Weston, we're just going to keep hitting this... Don't think I have any silver ore. Yeah, this is efficient. Oh man, this is a really efficient route. Come on, hit, hit. Ah, oh, Todd, you fucker. Oh, don't, oh, through the fog. screwed out of it. God, I... Worth every septum. El Bozo. Ah, 
I love this game. I love it. I love this game. I love the hustle. Ah, shit. I got rid of my... I hate this game. I got rid of my silver ore. See, I lose focus. That's what happens. Why does it have to get so hot in this room when I close the door, man? Uh, yeah, hey, uh, folks, it is hitting me now. I'm getting sudden onset regret about this plan. This is not a, you know, a foolproof journey to Karth Waston. We're going to run into some nonsense on the way there. I'm probably not even going the right way. It's closer to Dragon's Bridge. It's like right in this area. See, like, there's already things right here trying to kill me. And there's things killing each other over here. Are they attacking the... I can't tell who's on whose side. Oh, that's abandoned. Okay. They're all gonna try and kill me. I thought it was just the regular Alakir guys. What is going on? I assume you died if you're sending your stream over. How did it go? How we doing, friends? Don't power attack. It's just nonsense. Time out. Rock joint! Every fucking time, it's rock joint. It's always rock joint. It's always been rock joint. Good to see y'all, though. How are you? This is a pretty rough start so far. Thank you, if Tom, you sir. Hold on, what's like? Let me let me get out of this fight. Let me let me let me get out of this fight. Lightning, thank you very much for 19 months. Hit the. Okay, uh, uh, if you are curious of the rules of this run, exclamation point rules will explain at least the vast majority of it. But our main goal right now, what we're trying to do, we want to get to Karth Waston. Because we've had a really Thank easy time kind, collecting sir. gems. So we want to craft silver jewelry, not gold jewelry. We want to craft silver jewelry because that's how we're going to be able to, with the least amount of materials, make the most expensive jewelry and get our smithing grinding out of the way. We get our smithing grinding out of the way. We're going to hit the Dark Brotherhood, complete as many of those quests as we can, and then try to hit Dawn Guard before our 30 days run out. Every time I die, we lose five hours. More wolves. Perfect. And every time we die, we spin the wheel and perhaps lose some of the gear that we have painstakingly and manually crafted. It's pretty much the exact same as the Iron Man we did before, except it's not permadeath and it's not. Uh, we have a time limit. Uh, Sech Snee, thank you so much for the prime. Thank two you, mellows kind, music. Sir. Oh, I, it, it just scrolled away before I got to reading it. Two mellow. I've, I feel like I've heard of two mellow. I've probably heard of two mellow because you probably told me about them. But I hope the stream went well. Is uh, the long road. It reminds me of Route 96. Or I feel like those two games are fairly similar. Two red dots. Is it wolves? I already got rock joint, so I can take as much damage as I need to. Oh god, I thought I heard footsteps. It's just them gyrating. Please stop. Stop, it's terrifying. I need to... What if something's up with my seat? Hold on.
Juve, what do you think of the far, far away idol side content on the Shrek 2 disc? That is a blast from the fucking past. I actually remember that. It's like, a, it's not quite deleted scenes. It's like an extra skit that they did, right? On the DVD for Shrek 2, which I did have, of course. That's wild. <laughs> it's just, I feel so blessed to have been reminded about that stellar content on this day. So another dumb strategy we're going to do, we have to drop our silver ore and transmute so that we don't change the silver ore into gold ore. It may seem counterintuitive. Why not just make gold stuff? Well, gold only takes really valuable gems for jewelry like diamonds and sapphires. So we want to focus on things like garnets and amethyst because we're collecting them at a pretty decent clip. So Karth Wastan is a place where we can get a really good amount of silver. You may be wondering, why not just wait so you get your magic back faster and you can transmute all of the iron really quickly? Well, if I wait, stupid ethereal bastard. In doing so, that would pass time and I would run out of time. We only have a limited amount of it. Suggesting that Ruby is... Oh, I, I'm, I don't know the exact prices. I'm trying my best here. I'm on my way to Windhelm to join up with this. Oh, no, he's going to say something like. Uh, something about Skyrim being his home. Oh, no, it's a courier. I'm over two. I got the value of my gems wrong. I'm getting my dialogue predictions wrong. What time is it 8 p.m.? We still have a little bit of light. I'm not going to save here. A little bit hungry, but we have plenty of food. If you came over from Jabo stream and you're curious on what mods we're using, exclamation point mod list covers most of them. It's not the most stable mod list in the world, but it's my mod list. Uh, there's one or two mods we're using that aren't in there. Though. I thought she was about to say arrow in the knee. Which would have been wild. I've never heard a child say that. What difficulty is this? We're playing uh, Survival and Expert. Although we do have Blade and Blunt, which changes the balancing a little bit, as well as Precision, which changes the hitboxes and some of the movement. I'm not the biggest fan of using a one-handed weapon with Precision, but it's what we went with for this run. No. Oh, we just crashed. Speaking of, told you it's not the most stable. For some reason, the reach is where the vast majority of my crashes happen. Don't really know why. Did I just save? Tell me I just saved, please. Oh, hell yeah. And I know we're about to get jumped by a wolf. Worth every septum. Cheer 1000 thanks for the stream again, Juve. L about the crash lol you did save. Good job, because I appreciate that. Thank you. Wait, nope. We have to drop before... You gotta be careful though. Where the fuck do you keep coming from, dude? Scaring the hell out of me every time. Alright, I have to be a little bit vigilant here. 
We're definitely going to have to outrun at least one saber cat. I need to get some height. A little bit of height, get camp set up. I don't like this. This screams saber cat. 100%. I know that tower. Uh, no, that's not Druidak Redoubt. I don't remember which, which camp that is. It's that one camp that we did in Chaos Mage where we ended up clearing two at the same time. It's only 9 p.m. Let's go... Seven hours takes us to 4.30. It's still going to be really dark out, but we'll get our sleep. Thank you, kind sir. Primers unite. Got to get to 30. Uh, we'll save the perk point on smithing for a little bit. One really weird thing with this build is we keep investing in lockpicking just because of bear traps. Light armor is probably the way we want to go, though. Try and stay survivable. Armor rating of light armor increased by 25 if wearing all light armor. Yeah. We'll take that buff. Ooh, and we got Aurora Borealis. At this time of day, at this time of year, localized entirely to Tauscar the Wanderer's route. Wolf over there attacking a deer. Let's just avoid it. Do I have any hawk feathers? We're going to have to find some. Hawk feathers will get rid of rock joint. I think if we hit that bridge... We should be really close to Karthwaston. Only problem is if I go down straight from here, yeah, there's a huge tower here, Forsworn. I can see one, in fact, right there, walking around. If we go in there and kill the boss, though, we can start Molag Ball's quest. However, that's not exactly... Not really a part of this run. Okay, just in case things go really bad... Shit. I don't have any plans to fight Forsworn. We might have gotten him there with that route. We clear? Don't kill me? Who are you? What's a milk drinker like you doing? Oh, fine. <laughs> Talk all the smack you want, sir. I have absolutely no plans in fighting you. All right, does anybody know where Karth Waston is to, like, compared to where I am? Is it north or is it south? Nah, it's got to be north. Thank you, kind sir. I think. Nice. Tauskar, I'm 99.999% sure he is not essential. I'm, I think we've killed him multiple times. Oh, it's right here. You can see it on the compass. What a route. We saved a lot of time.
sell swords out of my mind. Watch your tongue, native. We'll leave when we're sure there's no force war here. Hey, you guys want to see a cool trick? I know you guys are having like political strife and whatnot and disagreements, but look. Would that be Magic. You look a to sell my land to the silver blood. You sure you shouldn't be the silver blood. Of course he has to comment on the fact that I look like I'm sick. They always have to do that. you take it. If the force <laughs> like, they're in the middle of a really heated discussion. I want you people out of my town. No, we have a right to be here. Say hey, you got a cold? Ah, oh, this guy's sick. Get him out of here. Like, focus on the thing in hand, okay? Not my health. We're in control of this mine. No, the mine is closed. Get lost. So. I assume they're gonna try to kill me. There's no way I can tell them, hey, I'm cool, I just want to mine. You guys keep control of it. I'm not from here. I'm a cell sword. These are my men. Forsworn attacked a while back. Jarl had no men to spare. So the Silverbloods generously offered to send us to clean things up. We just want that old native to hand over his land in payment for our services. Then we'll leave, and everyone can get back to work. Sorry, Atar, I wasn't quite listening. I had to look at my really cool sword. I could... Oh, yeah, all right. I'm going to convince him to sell to you. Mm, do that, and I'll make sure you get a cut. Yeah, I could use the cash. And I don't really want to fight these guys because I know they're going to kick my ass. So let's ask him. Like, we could ask nicely. What? It's locked. Uh, it's 5 a.m. That's why. All right, I'm going to go into the mine and at least see. Please, will they attack me if I go in there? cool we all good we are in control it's mine no sudden moves massive this is going to be a huge leap forward I would bet by the time we have all of our gold, all of our iron and silver taken care of. No sudden moves. I want to be at around 50 smithing, which I think that means we need about 25 levels. But I have 10 amethyst. That's like three or four levels on its own. We're going to hear this uh, dialogue a lot. This is a good time, though, to take a break and talk about the sponsor of today's stream, FreeCreditReport.com. I still don't have any of the other Free Credit Report songs on, on my list, so you just still get this one. I was shopping for a new car. Which one's me? A cool convertible or an SUV? Too bad I didn't know my credit was wack. Because now I'm driving off the lot in a used subcompact F-R-E-E. That spells FreeCreditReport.com, baby. Saw their ads on my TV Thought about going but was too lazy Now instead of looking fly and rolling fat My legs are sticking to the vinyl and my posse's getting laughed at Legs are sticking to the vinyl and my posse's getting laughed at That sucks though, when your legs stick to the seat of your car Although I don't know if I would call it vinyl I thought that was just leather What are vinyl seats? What am I doing for my B-Day? Well, my B-Day was about 20 days ago, but what we did do was we went to those one of those restaurants. One of those really pricey places. Not like a Michelin star or anything, but it was definitely fake leather. Oh, then that's what I have sat on <laughs> my whole life then. I don't think I've ever had real leather seats. Uh, we went to this restaurant. 
that was really really pricey we are in control of this and it, it was like no, dude those appetizers i'm sorry like fine dining i get it if that's your thing those appetizers are fucking a scam scam one of the appetizers was like t t like 20 bucks 25 bucks or something and it was four i mean razor thin slivers of white like you could see through it it was like a razor thin sliver of fish with you know whatever sauce that it was in and stuff like insane amount of flavor right not complaining about how it tasted but it's like it's like 30 seconds of mm, yeah that's pretty good whoa i've never tasted something like that and then it's gone like i could have got dominoes for cheaper stuffed my face regretted it a couple hours later and at least been fed now the main courses were great it was like pizza and pasta and you know that kind of stuff that was fantastic no complaints there at all but i wish we just skipped on the appetizers and only did I'm out, gotta focus. I wish we skipped on the appetizers and only did the main courses. Those were good. So we got about 15 silver ingots. I don't really know if that's enough. We still have 30 iron ore, 13 corundum. I don't know how much steel I'm going to even need to make. We upgraded to a steel sword. That was worth it. But let's hold off on doing anything with that ore for now. Let's make out of here with some cash. I'm one of the few natives. No, this is my land. You expect me to just hand it over to those silver blood thugs? Do I have to beat the shit out? Oh, I... The, oh no, I can pay it. I'm not gonna lose money on this deal. Someone has to stand up to them. I won't sell. Easy, I'll sell. Just don't hurt anyone. All right, let's go. Let's go. All right then. I'm not sure why he's intimidated by me. The only thing I've killed are wolves, a couple of bandits. Ah, uh, he's afraid of my bear trap. This is what he's afraid of. He doesn't want to step on that. It's deadly. Number one killer in the entire province. What's your favorite cheat food? Um, it's actually a tough one. Probably just like some bullshit pasta that I put together with like cheese and stuff. I don't know. Mine is clove. Like a shitty homemade mac and cheese. I guess this finishes up our contract with the blood. All right, 400 gold, decent amount, a little, right. little bit of cash. We got to do a good deed for the people of the Reach. Our business is done here. I know, that's why I'm leaving. They didn't see that good. That was a close call. Uh, now I have to re-steal it. I wonder what they're going to do. Are they going to kick them out? Kill them? Move along. Nothing for you to see here. What in the? What, did you say? what in the hell is that? Am I rolling? I don't have anything to say to you, stranger. I didn't mean that. All right, let's get out of here. Let's hit Markarth. Do what we can for crafting. At least, at least take it as far as we can. But then we have to do the Dark Brotherhood. We got to start knocking some quests off, getting some points on the board. I don't know who you think I am, and I 
don't care. Leave me alone. I don't have to... I've ran into these guys interrogating her like six times now. They just keep finding her every time she runs away. There's another mine in town before you... In that same town? Wait, with more silver? I'm... It, it's like I have a sixth sense in the reach and I know when it's about to crash. So I just save at the most opportune times. It's uncanny. I'm getting really good at it. Too good at it. Saving causes the crashes. There is some truth to that. Something happens with at least my current mod list where at least when I quick save, I've noticed crashing after quick saving quite often. Oh, shit. Is the cave y'all were talking about, is it in this town? Probably just check local map. Just a bit farther. Oh, I think it's yeah in that back corner. Good call. Thank you. Thank you. That saves us a lot of time. If this is some kind of troll and it's filled with spiders, I'm gonna fall for it. Huh? Huh? Ah! Ah! Uh, uh. Sorry. Don't mind me. No, you did not. No, no, you didn't. You just straight up didn't. Piss off. Why are there so many spider webs? Why does it look abandoned? Why is there no ore? Is this the only ore vein in here? <laughs> if there's just one, that'd be pretty funny. I won't be mad about it though. It's better than nothing. It's XP. No. Oh my gosh, that's the only one in here. You cheat and take shortcuts with magic? Yeah, I mean, I don't understand why nobody else in this universe uses magic. Can you blame me? Let's launder that silver. The one we stole. At least then if we get arrested, it won't steal. Uh, wait a minute. I'm not falling for it. It's gonna craft with all the legal ones that I have. It was gonna leave the illegal silver ore as the odd man out. Let's wash it. All right, we gotta have more than enough silver ingots now. At least to go through all the gems that we have. Is 
there any butterflies? There's not that many butterflies around the reach. Oh, way quicker route. I fucking knew it was going to crash again. It's something with the reach. I can't figure out exactly what it is in my load order, but it's something. I was about to save my game, too. Something in the reach, right in that little spot. We won't be in the reach for that long. Plus, with like a f a, a, the last few projects we've done, we've spent a lot of time in the reach. Although, unfortunately, that means I gotta wash my ingots again. Or my silver? S -s 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 silver. Why did I only make two? Hey, someone had to take it, right? Oh, what did you take? It don't look so good. Are you feeling? And then, right? then they go into insulting my appearance. Avaris, I appreciate it. That was that one was a ton of fun to make. Honestly, it was just a lot of fun to play. Please don't, please do not, uh, you know, I'm just going to save immediately right here. And we're out in front of these chodes. Still want to hit iron ore veins if we can. Butterflies. Line cliff. That is the hag raven, I think. Done with work. How'd your shift go? Question. You already have bounty for stealing that single piece of silver ore. If you drop it and pick it again when seen, you get a bounty in. Yes, I believe that counts as stealing twice. If you get caught the second time, I, I believe that the crime compounds, which is really funny because it's like if, if a robber stole from the cash register, dropped the bag of cash, but then picked up the bag of cash, is that another charge? At least that's what it seems like. Yep, we're going to hit the boat right here. It's got the gems. Emerald. Flawless diamond. This is just smithing XP. Pure smithing XP in this boat. I'm just going to save and try to spot myself through the rest of the reach until we get to Markarth. Now, do we save? Do we save the lady at the marketplace or do we just let her bite the dust? I think I should try to play hero. I'm down to be heroic. That makes sense, Asherem. This is my favorite part of the game. I just love this section of the map. It's stuffed with content. It's fairly like mid-level challenging. Depends on the settings and like mods you might be playing with. But I think in general, the reach is my favorite part of the map. 
There's a lot of random events that roam around. Again, kind of just depends on how you have your game set up. But it's very vertical. Lots of mountains, lots of caves that are kind of tucked away. It's got some good Daedra quests. Good rewards, cannibalism. Sydney mine. I see it asked on the Skyrim subreddit all the time. It's like, what's your favorite section of the game? What's like your favorite area? I feel like I feel like nobody ever shouts out the Reach. I feel like people don't like the Reach. Like, why all the Markarth hate? Be efficient and kill her yourself. You know what? You're right. Why would I let the Forsworn have all the fun? Now I'm gonna be the hero. Wait, I know you. Yeah, you're gonna know me as the hero of the marketplace murder. Saving the day, one at a time. What was that? We saved her. I'm the hero. I'm a good guy. Ma'am, are you okay? Stay back. The city By the gods, that man nearly killed me. You saved my life. Yeah, all in a day's work. Here. I was gonna bring this to my Please be a gem. Just be a gem. Oh, no, no, that's not exactly what I needed. I need it not together. Can you take it apart for me? Can you give me just the ingredients that it was made with? Uh, I guess I didn't make it, so. I didn't make it, and I can't disenchant it. So it's gotta go. Alright, finally. Look at that, gold diamond, 1200. This should give us a whole level. Close to it. Gold emerald, close to a whole level. Gold ruby. Now we're up to 27. Now we can come down to silver jeweled. 380. Silver amethyst ring, we can make 10 of them. Oh yeah. Ah, it feels so good. Uh, hold on, silver ruby ring. Just one. Thirty-two. I'm a little bit underwhelmed. I thought we would have gotten a lot more. I do have a ton of leather. But not that much leather. Is that Nordic Barnacle? Hold on, let's see where that leaves us. So we got one silver ingot. No way, it's flagged as stolen. When did I? Oh, okay, I do remember stealing it. 27 iron ore. So we could turn that into 13 silver or gold ingots. I probably should just hold on to it for now. I'm Boris's assistant. We definitely leveled up again at the very least. We can go to, oh, we can go to Merrick. Oh, but we won't have Moonstone. Advanced Workshop. You may choose to upgrade one grindstone or workbench to an advanced version for 2,500 gold. The hell am I gonna get the gold? It improves items one tier higher. Items can be improved beyond legendary, can be disassembled by sneaking. That's not bad if I can get the gold for it. But I also need to save up my gold to buy a house if we wanna get the maximum you know, amount of points, which I don't, I don't know if we're even going to be able to get a house because I haven't done too many Thane related activities. Let's move on. 
Let's keep our crafting materials as we have them and just move directly to the Dark Brotherhood. We got the three contracts we killed to turn in. We'll get some gold there. Come on in. The silver blood this in one's has a plenty of strong life. drink and a legend we all know and love. Come on, get over here. This is the silver. Sure thing. It's your. I'll show you to your We just want to take the level up. Halfway to level nine. Not as good as I was hoping. Let me know if there's anything else. What do you need? Where can we get Moonstone? Or should we skip Moonstone? Although I could make... Oh, we get to choose an item type. Contemporary Mer Mer Merrick, Elven, Chitin, Dwarven. We can make a Dwarven sword. And then in here we can go... Wait, scaled at 50? We're using Ordinator, by the way. The auto cannon seems kind of funny. I don't know if I'd be able to find the amount of stuff to throw it out, especially if it's one time use. It's mainly in dwarven. Okay, I mean, I could go. I could take this perk, pick dwarven, and make a dwarven sword. Investing a second perk point lets you pick both. Up against my better judgment. I'm going to take it. I'm going to go Dwarven. Try to make a Dwarven sword so I can at least up my DPS. And because it looks cool. The <laughs> Dwarven sword just looks cooler. It's golden. I can't keep rolling with this basic steel sword. I want the gold one. Dwarven metal ingot, steel ingot. Dwarven metal ingot. I know we can make a steel ingot for sure. They don't like us talking to Get out of the way. Uh, we need a piece of Dwemer metal. That shouldn't be too hard to find in Markarth. I'm already here. You think there's some in the church? Or in that, like, museum guy's room? Yeah, the museum. Exactly. All right, Chad, see, we're, we're operating on the same wavelength here. Dwemer Museum isn't open to anyone without the court wizard's permission. Ah, it's illegal. Now you're keeping us from seeing our honored dead. You and the Jar of Galadriel are for any desecration of my ancestors. It's only an adept lock. gonna be guards in here we just have to steal one piece I think that works please tell me that's all we needed to do I'll be so pumped if that's it I can't steal the creation club weapon that's in there I didn't craft it if I want to use any piece of armor or weapon, I have to manually craft it. <clears throat> oh, 
Oh, that's right. We need to figure out how to cure my disease really fast. Six metal ingots. They're clean. Hell yeah. All right, give me the dwarven sword. How about some armor? Wait, whoa, wait, whoa, wait, whoa. Thank you, kind sir. 14. Got it. Okay, it's an upgrade. Uh, the damage number seemed really, really low, but that's because I have rock joint. Oh, pff, wait, I have plenty of money. We can pray. I don't need a cure disease potion. It's a hundred gold, but I gotta get rid of this. Wait, I know you. Juma's bro, thank you very much for the tier one. The sisters are communing with Debella. They can't be disturbed. It's fine. You'll have to come back another time. Now what do we have for damage? 19. There we go. Not a big buff, but a buff nonetheless. Oh, yeah, yeah, he's a big fan. He knows me. Out of my way, outsider. All right, we're off. To the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary. How are we doing on time? We have 22.4 days remaining. Still quite a bit of time. How far of a run is it there? Oh, Lord. Yeah, we're going to lose some time here. Although I think we made really, really good time between white run all the way back here Climb and back and we'll be off. we have a decent amount of gold so we'll probably lose i don't know what time it is now actually it's okay it's 2 23 p.m we can get a good gauge here on how many hours we're gonna lose oh jim is broke congratulations on the engineering job that's awesome that only cost us three hours it doesn't seem horrible. Especially because on the way down here, I would have gotten distracted, gotten into a couple fights. Although those fights do have some tangible benefit with XP and loot. Oh, we totally forgot to help Cicero. That was a, what, 500 gold? We should have gone for that. Keep talking, little man, and we'll see who gets punished. I'll be quiet, you great lumbering lapdog. The man has had a long journey. At least be civil. Mr. Cicero. That's right, you lumbering lapdog. That's Dark Brotherhood lingo for... You bitch. You. You suck. Uh, why is my... Oh, what a kind and wise wizard you are. Sure to earn our lady's favor. You and the Night Mother are of course welcome here. I don't really fit in here. Everyone's got the uniform on. deserving of your position as keeper. Understood, husband? Her. Oh, Armbjorn and Astrid, you guys are an item? I haven't done the Dark Brotherhood in forever. I don't really know any of these people. 
I'm not all that interested in what they got to say right now just because I am uh, sh I'm short on time. Where's my guy? There you are. Dexter Deshawn. Good to see you again. Talk to Astrid. She's by the pool greeting the night mother and her little jester. She has a contract for you. Come see me afterward. No, I want to turn in this and get my money. Haven't you talked to Astrid? Dude, pay me. This is why you and V never worked out. This is why things went south. All right, Astrid, where are you? done speaking with that muttering fool anyway he's right he's you know he's he's he's, he's listening in right now it's like hmm. were they talking about me all right astrid what you got for me ass i do indeed you must go to the city of markarth and speak with the Fuck. <laughs> you'll probably find her in the hag's cure when the shop is open the girl's been running her mouth wants an ex-lover killed She's apparently performed the Black Sacrament. Her name is Muir. You may have, maybe I misheard you, Astrid. It sounds like you said Markarth. And carry it out. Just do whatever the contact wishes. Ah, uh -huh, that's far. Present us well and get the job done. Since it's your first contract, I'll let you keep whatever Muiri pays. She'll be generous, I'm sure. They always right. are. Quit talking. It's gonna take me a long ass time anyway to get over there. Don't let my Why Markarth? Why? It could have been any other city. I see you're back from Dawnstar. Baytilde lies dead, I hope. Baytilde is dead. Of course she is. I could do this all day. Here's your payment. Congratulations. You slaughtered an emaciated beggar in cold blood. Thank you very much. I'm very proud of the hard work that uh, it took. You know, it was a very smooth operation. Finally. Oh, it feels so good to hit that button and finally get some points. Good. And I hope you were careful in that lumber mill. Those splinters and rusty nails can be quite nasty. Your payment for a job well done. How are we doing on gold? 1,357? Thank you, kind sir. All right, we got to get back to Markarth. Quickest way is probably going to be on foot. Let's sleep. There's got to be a bed in here, right? Owned? Thank you, kind sir. Am I a member of the guild but or this not? This second trimester Twitch baby is really taking a number on my hot bod. <laughs> Your hot bod? Oh, I thought it said hot bot. Uh, Avarice, thank you so much for the prime. DC cred, thank you for five months. Yeah, once the Twitch baby starts kicking. Shit gets crazy. Oh, another member of the family. Hello, not interested. Hello. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. Okay. Remain focused. Goal oriented. Did I not level up? Did I even sleep in the bed or... Of course it's raining. Why wouldn't it be raining? Why wouldn't it be pitch black and raining? We got quite a while until we're back at Markarth. So I'll check in. How is everybody doing? Chad, how are you? How are you holding up?
Mora? Yes, we need Mora. Spider? And it's dark out. I can't see anything unless it's like two feet in front of me. Spriggan? No, no, wrong way, incorrect direction. I feel like we're taking a somewhat decent route out of here, though. Trying to hug rocks, mountainsides, awkward ledges and whatnot, just in case I do get followed. Throw them off the scent. Wolf? Two? I think this is the hunter's cabin. I'm torn. I want to wait until morning. But I also don't want to waste time. I also want to please Sithis. We might be good on food for like this whole run. That was at least a week's worth of food or close to it. Spider, what is that? Yeah, spider again. It's not one of the little guys either, so we got to avoid it. It's only 9.50. This looks like midnight. I know, wouldn't that be great? Uh, some kind of potion or some kind of consumable that at least staves off sleep for a little bit. We're making really good time. Look at that, we're making great time. And we just gotta hang a Larry up here. Move west, follow the river, try not to get ourselves killed. I thought that was a bear trap. Yikes. Hendraheim? I would love to just go right into Hendraheim because it's a cheat code, but we'll pass on it for now. Right over this hill, there's at least a bear and a couple of really large spiders. Whoa! Oh no, there's a bear right next to me. Forgot about that one. If I could see, I'd go over the mountain that way. I don't know if it's possible. God 
Jesus, he's right there. Ah! Enough, enough. Ah, I'll wait with you. Demon, be gone. How do I get down? How do I get down? I don't know how to get down. I'm, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm, I'm literally, I'm, I'm gonna have to, um, I'm gonna have to jump off the cliff. Hold on, I can see ground. I'm alive. I'm, I'm, oh, I'm, I'm not, I'm, I'm alive, dead, I'm alive, I'm dead. I'm alive, I'm, I'm alive. Red dots everywhere. Okay, it's a Forsworn hideout. We just have to watch out for the archers if there are any. Uh, can I survive? Can I make this jump? Fuck it. <laughs> yeah. The cool guy escape. Oh my god, this is the most efficient route I think I've ever taken across the whole map. We're flying. Can we take the current? I need a break from the rain. We're safe. We're safe. We're safe. It's all good. No, we're not. Yes, we are. It's a slaughterfish. Whew, that was stressful. Good call, whoever said to save. Oh my, oh my God, bad call, whoever said to save. Fuck you, whoever suggested it. Enough, enough, enough. No, I'm so over this. So over this nonsense. I'm hanging out under the water. No more. It's calm down here. I can I can be safe. See, like up here, chaotic, loud, obnoxious, deadly. Down here, calm, quiet, serene. Hard to breathe. Goats. Fish. Aren't you a wood elf? Use your racial. You're right, that would help. However, I would have at least been scared by one of them. Or by both. Can a wood elf use their racial ability to command Khajiit? Let that one roll around in your brain. Let that one rattle around. Why not? There, it's a cat. It's bipedal. Fanfic. Okay, I, I wasn't going in that direction. I just meant like a, hey, don't kill me. I'm not that bad. Once you get to know me, don't don't attack me. <laughs> Shut up. Okay, they're not vampires. Dude, I heard a car outside and I thought it was something in game. I was like, what? I, th I thought it was a cow mooing. Um, 
just an F-150. Control weather spell should be legal, right? What's that command again? Timeout. Maybe I have to enter it every single time I play the game. But there's a command somebody let me know about where I can cut down how much it rains. It's actually obnoxious. I, I love how Obsidian Weathers looks. It looks fantastic. But it is really, really annoying. Set global overcast rain to default value is 10, 3. Global overcast, wait, what? Global season. Two, three. Global season. Storm. Rain. Two. One. Now they should pop up less often. He seems pretty calm to me. He's telling me fun facts and everything. All of you freaked out. The proof is on my side right now. I can't believe we got here this quick, though. 12.30 a.m. So that means we were able to... Carriage ride from Markarth to Falkreath run to the Dark Brotherhood, turn in our quest, start this quest, and then run on foot all the way back to Markarth. You know, in under 12 hours? Sig way under 12 hours, in under 8 hours. That feels really good. Markarth isn't for horribly far from Falk. <laughs> I, I beg to differ. Look at that. That is. It's farther from Falkreath than it is from Whiterun, based on these rudimentary measurements I'm doing with my fingers. Okay, fingers on the monitor. All right, if I put my finger on Falkreath, and on Markarth, and then I rotate it, that would put it... That can't be right. My measurements were off. It's a very far run. How many football fields? Probably like 48. If I had to give it my best guess, I'd say 48 football fields. Dude, you're a little bit late to this whole thing, okay? I saved her like a week ago. I just need to warm up. I'm soaking wet. I'm sopping. Alright, are we supposed to kill this lady in here? Why are you looking at me like that? You're my client. The Dark Brotherhood has come, Moiri. Why would you say that? The door is not even closed. Oh, let, All right, then. let me immerse myself. Okay, now now let's 
The Dark Brotherhood has come. The Dark Brotherhood. Oh, oh, I, my goodness, you're really here. The Black Sacrament, it actually worked? Uh, obviously. <laughs> yep, clearly. What I need is for Elaine Dufont to die. I want him hunted down and murdered like the dog he is. Yeah, but my sword's really cool. Have you seen my sword? It's kind of cool. It's kind of sweet. It's kind of sick. Okay, I need more on that. I didn't know it when we were with each other, but Elaine is actually the leader of a band of cutthroats. Bandits. It's really interesting, but have you considered my sword is made of gold? Raldbathar. It's near Windhelm. They use it as their base. It's where they stage their raids. I want you to go to that ruin, find Elaine Dufont, and kill him. I don't care about his friends. Do whatever you want with them. But Elaine has to die. Excellent. Once Elaine is dead, I'll pay you. In gold. I've saved up a bit. I hope that'll do. But, well, there is one more thing. If, if you can, I want you to kill someone else as well. You don't have to, not as part of our deal, but if you do, I'll pay you even more. It's Nilsine Shattershield in Windhelm. If Nilsine dies too, I'll make it worth your while. Wait, why do you want her dead? I can't ask why she wants Nilsine dead. Okay, <laughs> all right, well, Nilsine will die. Mm, maybe not. Maybe I only kill the one, because that would complete the quest. We get our three points, we move on. Is Nilsine the one? Oh, I know Nilsine. We've killed their entire bloodline before. It's like, if you kill Nilsine, doesn't the mom kill herself? Traveling in the Where do you want to go? Climbing back and we'll be off. Climbing back and we'll be off. Alright, so it's 1.53 a.m. I mean, this is a cross-map journey. Uh, oof, that's tough. We lose six hours. I mean, that would have taken me longer to get up here. Lane Dufont, he's just up here. I mean, I'm in Windhelm. I might, we might as well take out the bonus target. Why not? How many quest points do you need to take on dragons? I mean, I guess we could do... If we became Thane of Whiterun, we'll get a decent amount. My only issue with that is I feel like I've become Thane of Whiterun multiple times on the channel. Moeri's payment is a decent alchemy ring? Wait, really? We can disenchant that. Twenty one point six five days left. What? Did you need something? Did you hear that? It's the sound of your sister screaming in the void. Uh, maybe I don't pick any of these options. Both of these seem like they would just give away my cover. Mawiri sent me. She is. What did Nilsine do? I gotta know what the T is. Why am I killing her? Moiri? I can't believe my family trusted that backstabbing little strumpet. You tell her she's dead to us. You hear me? Dead. Wait, why? Can you explain? Who wrote all those names? Are those graves? That's kind of eerie. All right, well, if I'm going to kill her, I don't want to wait until nighttime when it's easier to kill her. I also don't want to go to jail. It'd be about a thousand gold for me to murder her right here. I don't know if I can get away with this. 
My arrow is certainly not going to kill her in one hit. <gasps> Bear trap. You're right. It might not work in one hit, though. I'm also assuredly going to get caught. Oh, this is going to be a disaster. I'm going to get myself killed. I know it. I have nothing to say to you. Just leave me alone. Fine, fine. I'll leave you. Oh, God. The mate's trying to talk. God might get nervous. A man approaches with his weapon drawn. Someone do something. Oh, who stepped on it? The R Lonely Gale, you're not the target. Easy, easy, it's just assault. It's just assault. Arrest me. You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your def- 40 gold. All good. It's just assault. We're good. That won't pass that much time. We've lost like an hour since we've been here, though. No more stops. We need to find our way to solitude. Why are we even going this way? Look at her. The way she walks around the marketplace. So smug. Stay right there, Nilsine. That is a powerful ass bear trap. Mm. She's gonna approach the meat stand. Drop the bear trap. Chicken, do not walk forward. Whatever you do. Don't, no, no. Bag away. Oh, oh, the, God damn, she's slippery. Oh my God, why does it always have to be lonely, Gale? That's <laughs> an egg. I seriously. Everybody, let's calm down now. Let's take it easy. Okay. Right. I'll pay the fine. It's only 40 gold. I'm gonna accidentally kill Lonely Gale though by the time this is over. She's still at the market, shopping and moving and discussing and talking. And I hate her. Is she going to the meat stand? What's her order of operations here? Lonely Gale, don't even think about it. I can't get away with this. I'm just gonna have to eat the charge. I, plan to change a few I swear to God. <sighs> okay, it didn't hit him. It didn't count. If it's a fight you want, I'm ready this time. Come on, Nelsine. Do it. This fucking guy. There we go. Oh my gosh, this bear trap is annoying me. Come here, come here. Come here. I'm gonna drop it right on her head and it's just gonna clamp. Just ready for this to be over. There! That 
that's what you get for shopping so much. I hate this game. I hate this game. I I am I am I uh, I mean it. I mean it. I hate this fucking game, dude. It's the dumbest game I've ever played in my life. It has zero redeeming qualities. Well, we lost another five hours. This is honestly a detriment now. We're, we're in trouble here. This is bad. Where's my wheel? If I lose my sword, that's it. I've had it with this fucking wheel. Why has it got to be backpack every time? It's always backpack. It's been backpack three times now. This one pissed me off. I'm a little upset. Bogus. Oh, now I'm over conumbered. But now I'm retired. Oh, but like 60 pounds. I think I can make another backpack though. Yeah, yeah, we're all right. It's all good. We got we got another backpack. Not a problem. Now let's just take care of business. Careful with that. I mostly deal with petty thievery and drunken brawls. Is there a way I could take her out without getting caught though? This has to be a really good throw. She's gonna go that way, and then we catch her on the return. I've been a bit out of sorts since. All right, all right. There's a lot of collateral damage that's possible here. Oh no! Oh no! 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 <laughs> Everybody, get down! <laughs> Navigate the crowd. This is like a game of human Tetris. Align the blocks of human meat around, find where they fit in. Here's where the bear trap slides in. Nice and easy. Flippery doo da. Nice and easy. Focus, focus. Nice. Why didn't it kill you this time? Why didn't it? Why didn't it kill her? Why didn't it kill? Her? Wait, hold on, hold on. We're okay. It's just an assault charge. 40 gold. I'm still alive. She's still going to be at half health. It's all good. This is not as problematic as you might think. She's leaving. Where is she going? This is a golden opportunity. Got a nickname for anyone who trifles with our sports here. She goes right here. Bear trap down. Stamina pots. Pump them into my veins. Around the corner. I am hidden. I hate you, Nilsine. Alright, same thing. Pick it up. Lay it down. Being in the Dark Brotherhood is hard. They didn't tell me it would be this obnoxious. Throw it right here. Hide in the bushes. Lord of Seasons, I pray to you now that you might watch over the dead. Oh my gosh, how many times are you going to survive this thing? I have nothing. She's going home. I bet she's going home. If she is, I mean, she's going to be right up here. Zero witnesses. 
clean murder. Oh man, call me Kevin McAllister. Home Alone 4. Except I'm the bad guys. She'll never see it coming. She's on the way to the catacombs. No, she's not. She's coming home. See, I told you all. Leave the Home Alone shenanigans to me. All right, and if the trap doesn't get the job done, my arrow will. No, I trust. Of course. Why? Why did I trust it? God, she's going to be home soon. Can you just die, please? Die, die. Step right on it. Unbelievable. This is this is out of control. I have nothing to say to you. Thank you, kind sir. Well done, Agent Juve. <laughs> thank you, thank you very much. And that is how you get away with murder. It's a complicated process of leading your victim into a vulnerable position. And that's when you strike. No witnesses, no noise, no fanfare, no nothing. Clean kill. That's how you get it done. We are gonna eat into our time here quite a bit though. I have to go to sleep. Wait, what time is it? Uh, 3 p.m.? I'm not going to sleep. We're just gonna go right to the dungeon. We still have some daylight. Let's hit the dungeon. I have camping supplies we can use. That should be all right. You know, if we level up, we can get a quick nap in. Yeah, the only thing on my record is assault. Not murder. I did the murder. But the only thing on my record is the assault. Follow me for more unethical life pro tips. Once again, these are not serious. Uh, this is not serious life advice, please. Please, do not, do not take anything I say seriously. Do not try to implement Skyrim strategies into real life. Doesn't work. I almost don't want to fight wolves anymore. They're just going to give me rock joint. I'll take it. Cheating. I'm taking your advice seriously and now I'm joining the real life Dark Brotherhood. Please, no, no, no. Do not. Talscar, is that you again? Quit following me. What is he even doing with his degree from the Bard's College? Walking around the dangerous parts of the map singing? That doesn't really seem like a good application of it. He should be a house bard, somewhere like the Bannered Mayor. He's better than Sven. No, chat, please do not join the actual real life Dark Brotherhood if they exist. I am not sure if they do exist, but if they do, please do not submit an application through their website and portal. And absolutely do not leave your email to be put onto their message list. That, was, that is the cutest fox I've ever seen. Hold on. You are, look at you, he's adorable. He looks like a little wolf. But I need the XP. Sorry, had to happen. Yes, please do not use my referral code. Fudge. It's getting closer. Oh, no, 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 I'm dead. Now it's over. Oh, 
Why has it got to be an ice wraith? How close? Close enough. Little camp. I think that's... Okay, it's a bandit. Oh, I only have one thing of camping supplies. Am I midway? Yeah, we're about halfway there, so I am. I'm going to throw down my camp. Cannot build a campsite while I'm not in combat. <sighs> this dungeon is going to destroy me. I'm so underpowered. My light armor skill is not very good. I don't have very many one handed perks. Now I'm freezing to death. It still won't let me throw up camping supplies. Is that an ice wolf or a regular wolf? That's ah, an ice wolf. I'm in real trouble here. We're in real big trouble here. Stop it. Confuse him with rocks. Yeah, dude, that it's so tanky. Uh, I don't know how to get out of this. This is a problem. Why did I use my spell? I used my power on a Khajiit. I thought it was funny. There we go. I do fantasy racism and, and now I'm now I'm fucked. We just gotta use rocks. Thank you, kind sir. We stay on rocks, we stay alive. I think we're good. I think we're free! Just gotta take a second to think through. Okay, he didn't follow. We're good, we're safe. Crisis averted. It's all good, we're good. Ah, jeez, man. No, it's not what I want. No, 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 no. Okay, Archer up top. Come on, bear trap. That's the last of them. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. This is bad. This is going so poorly. I wanted to get my camp set up. Oh, I wanted to get my camp set up so badly. That hurts. That one really, really hurts. I still can't believe Isabella's gone. She was such a helpful young lass. Sure thing. Am I fucked up for hearing a character who has the same voice actor as Nazim be like, Oh, it's so sad that my daughter has died tragically, but it's Nazim's voice actor, so I'm sitting there being like, Yeah, yeah, sucks for you. But like, it's not Nazim, it just, it sounds like him. So in my head, I'm like, good, good. All right, this is not good. We're starting to really. Yeah, we're, we're starting to really load up on these deaths.
its backpack again. It's fu- How does this keep happening? <laughs> How does it keep happening? Why is it backpack every time? The one that I made Barbie themed. Believe Isabella's gone. She was such a helpful young lass. Oh, that's not his daughter. How can Elda hate the Dark Elves when she knows so little about them? Oh, pardon me. Was I in your way? Yeah, kinda. Okay, it's time to lock in. It's time to lock in and get serious. I can't believe this armor sucks, though. I look cool. I shouldn't suck. Is the wheel? I don't think the wheel's broken. So immersive. I mean, sooner or later, I'm going to run out of stuff. Amazing that the sign assaulted me. All right, new plan. We approach the, uh, the, 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 the fortress, the compound. We approach it carefully, tactically, stealthily. Mm, maybe not with stealth. Like the armored means like a feet. Yeah, it also means one simple wooden arrow puts me in the grave. I wish the guards were more honest about that. Lightly armored means light on your feet. And you'll get your shit pushed in really quickly. Thanks, guard. Appreciate the advice. This is the worst build I think I've ever played. A lockpick main, light armor. One-handed, zero magic ability with a major in smithing. A major in smithing with a minor in lockpicking. There you go. I don't know why backwards jumping always works the best. me going the right way why did i jump up this mountain i for some reason i was thinking that this mountain was really close to the objective but no it's still like a really long run away all i did was take longer and now i'm even colder
fucking mountain. Ooh. All right, it's not all so bad. It's bad, it's bad, it's bad. Really, dude? I'm trying to mine Corundum here. Oh, golly. How does this keep happening? I should be able to keep him away from me, though. Pretty easily. I don't know how I ended up taking this route. I don't even know what route I'm taking. This is a disaster. Uh, he's actually gonna go for it. I was feeling a little bit down about this dungeon. Maybe it's just going to be completely impossible for us to complete. But then I thought, if RuneScape YouTubers can perform the exact same action for 12 hours straight, and as a result get 13 seconds of content out of it, I can clear this dungeon. However, what I'm going to do, we're going to put our camping supplies down, yes. All right, sweet. Now we got the camp down. This is what we wanted to do last time. Seriously? He's trying to take a small nap. Ooh, that was close. I need to warm up. I gotta be careful though, this little ridge to my right slows me down when I kinda hit it. I get my warmth back, I get my speed back, we close the gap, we take him out. Easy peasy. Then we level ourselves up, we'll be a little bit more powerful going into the dungeon. can't see him. You can't win this. Oh, he about got me there. That was really close. And my max health is nerfed really, really badly right now, so he probably could have killed me. Got to go health again. Do I go? I think I want to go one-handed mastery again. I have to. Uh, I got to buff my damage. Something's got to give. I need it. All right. That warmed us up. So we'll have max speed right around that little bend. And then we're in front. Damn, this mountain looks good, though, early in the morning. Isn't that gorgeous? Looks good. Oh, I slept funky last night. I'm all sore. Oh my, what in the what? Same strategy before. Stay on rock, stay alive. We have command animal. We're going to take advantage of this ice wolf. We just can't let him hit us. Come on, buddy. Come on. Let's go invade a fortress. Just you and me, pal. Ooh, damn. 
Thank you, kind sir. No way, I can't get up this little hump. I gotta push the archer. Melee guy's distracted by the dog. Go down. Loser. How you doing up there, pup? Come on, cast it, cast it. Nice. All right, we're still alive. Take out this last archer. Mm. Need a stumble there, that was huge. <laughs> that last little hit was awesome. Throw her into a full backflip. Ah, that's tough. I lost too many of my healing potions. It's all right, Max Cable doesn't need performance enhancing drugs. <laughs> Did Max Cable become the most popular kid in school using performance enhancing drugs? No, and I won't either. This is so bad. This is really bad. The only thing going for me is that it's warm in here. What's my damage with this sword right now? 22? It's not too bad, actually. Go, no, go back to sleep. Go back to sleep. Go. to focus in there for a second. I almost got really, really salty because my power attack caught itself on the wall and wouldn't let me swing. But I'm not dead. Here we go. All right. Throw my candy in. What is that? Okay, see, this guy deserves for me to kill him because of their ridiculous cooking methods. You're gonna overcook the skeever. I got a really dumb idea. Let's try it. It, sh it really, it hit the trap. I hate this game. I genuinely, I mean it when I say I hate this game. I didn't really do enough damage. <gasps> no, you cheater. That's cheating. That's cheating. That's cheating. I'm dead. Oh, now I'm totally gone. Later. I don't have any stamina. Missed. Nice try. Nice, we got the hit with the bear trap. We're still alive. 
What do we got for potions? Three? Yikes. Not good. Very bad, in fact. Need to create some separation from that archer without getting involved with more enemies. Nope, nice try. Ah, uh, the archer's here, I'm dead. That's gonna hit me. Unless I can move left. Ha 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 very funny Elaine Dufont very hilarious strategy wow I was cooking there for a second come on I was kind of kicking ass you saw that little sidestep of the hammer when he was swinging that down come on I had him the archer came and fucked it all up. Now that sadly counts. This is when it lands on sword. It's gone backpack every single time. This is when it goes sword. Ring, we're safe. Yes. That's why we gamble, folks. That's why we gamble, because sometimes you win. I can't wait. We'll charge ourselves the five hours when we get out of here. Did I count that death, by the way? Are we at seven? There's a dwarven ballista you can use to kill the mark. Good to know. Oop. We just have to have a better strategy with our bear trap here. That's what cost me last time. So we go bear trap down. This is definitely the weakest of the bunch that's out here. Not great damage, but decent enough. Yo, bear trap. Smoke him. Not even gonna bother killing him. I'd love the one-handed XP. Maybe we could just avoid that room altogether. Adept lock, there's the ballista on the other side of the room. So I have to sneak through the room in order to activate it. I don't know why I decided to keep these fortify sneak potions that I made. I don't know why I even made them. But let's do this. This is our best opportunity here to get out of this clean and get some points on the board. How long is it, 60 seconds? That's plenty of time. Nice. <laughs> nice. What am I using? Toothpicks or lockpicks? No. Well, you must have all those annoying. Over here. That works so well. Got him. Target down. Can't take that, unfortunately. Woo! I'm out of here, losers. Lock the arrows. I did not think we were going to be able to complete this quest at all. Nope. I thought we stood zero chance at it. Woo! Not too shabby. I'm a little bit upset that I didn't get it the first time perfectly. But that's okay. We lost an extra five hours. Big whoop. Best route for us. Hit the stable, fast travel to Falkreath. 
damn we're gonna lose like a whole day just for this quest maybe even a little bit more than a day but we got the bonus uh do we have to go to markarth frick we gotta go markarth then falk wraith this is like a 12 hour investment dang although we'll be at seven points we complete one more quest after this one then we're at 10 points and we can buy uh permanent access to a vendor it's a give and take you know we lost 10 hours from dying didn't lose a whole lot of time sleeping uh well we died going for the bonus objective so we lost 15 hours due to death. I've been looking trying to do the math in my head. Got something I'm supposed to do. Looks like that's it. Got to go. We lost 15 hours from dying. I'd say six hours during the actual gameplay. Six hours fast travel. So about 27 hours. Ten days are gone now, though. Uh, good shout out, whoever suggested the Ballista. I don't know what happened, though, with his dialogue. It all happened so quickly, and I just wanted to get it over with. But what happened there, looking back, he talked to me. I broke the dialogue and ran to the Ballista. Him trying to talk to me again is what got him killed. Because if he aggroed and went directly into combat, I doubt he would have stayed in the range where the Ballista kills him. That's why I was freaking out and was just like, go, 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 gotta go, gotta hit it. Because I thought he would attract out of the center of the room. I think the Ballista only hits in one spot to kill him. If he's out of the center of the room, it won't kill him. Ball oh, shut the fuck up. I'm, I'm talking a lot, all right? I get why I get to say one thing wrong. Besides, we got people in here from the Northeast US. We got people from the West Coast US, from the Southern US, from Canada, from the UK. We say all our shit differently. Some people say shite. I'm stressed. We're running out of time. We got people from Brazil. Portugal. I don't know what you say in Portugal. I only know very introductory Brazilian Portuguese, not Spanish Portuguese. Uh, no, we still have to pass the five hours. Jersey, you're from Chicago? Bear down. Hey, hey, that's how it was referred to in the Portuguese textbook. All right. Go out, go out. I, I, I trust my professor, though. She is from Sao Paulo. It was like, it was like very early on. It was like talking about the difference between the two. Or like the very slight differences between the two. I don't know, that's what it said. Is it just Spanish though? Uh, five hours. There, there's your five hour tax. The Dawn Guard is looking for anyone willing to fight against the growing vampire. This is the first time I get to actually respond to him in the affirmative. Yeah, I'm in. Ha, Isran's going to like you. Go I don't know if we're going to have enough time, though, to even complete the Dark Brotherhood quest line. Nothing really that I want to craft here. 
In fact, I'm, I'm not sure why I came all the way into town. I just needed to go right to the... Right to the carriage. Oh yeah, no, Don Guard would kick my ass. What the hell almost killed me? How did I almost die? Need a ride? Where do you want to go? Climb and back and we'll be off. Sound feels good, huh? Nothing feels good right now. This has all gone terribly wrong. she at where did she go she in jail oh no she's at the uh alchemy shop i think please don't be locked i can't have it be locked in here i gotta save time oh you're standing outside for some reason what news is elaine elaine dufont is now dead thank you that bastard got exactly what he deserved and I heard about Nilsine. How? You have more than How? Part of the Please. What, did you get a text message? As payment and a symbol of my affection. I'll never forget you. Hell yeah, Mori's ring, 600 gold. That's big time. Mori's ring, creative potions are 15% more powerful. I'm going to go disenchant this. We don't have a... M oh, you know what we can do? All right, we're going to be a little bit more efficient, at least over this next section. I'm going to go to the wizard right here. We have a good amount of money. Let's buy a couple spells. Let's get Conjuration. I haven't found too many soul gems, but they'll probably pop up. Even if we can get just a little bit of buff in some of our gear and, you know, some kind of damage enchantment on our sword, it's going to help us out a lot. Well, I don't have any other enchanted gear. But Fortify Alchemy could help. And we'll get the XP. I'm Don't let my uncle go on about his What are you theories. doing here? here the excavation. Right. I told you. I. I'm sorry. I. I got spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. Soul trap. I do have some soul gems on me. Soul trap. Nice. Wonder if he has any healing spells. Wild healing. Heals the caster 40, then heals a random target within range 40 points. That's kind of funny. Strangulation. Absorbs 16 points of health per second for three seconds. I don't have a lot of magic to do that. Proves the caster's armor rating by 40 points. I'm going to take Oak Flesh. I'm actually going to use it. I think it could be helpful. If I focus on potions and then use Oak Flesh to buff myself, we can stay lightweight and get a little bit of a, a little bit of a buff. All right, carriage to Falkreath only takes about three hours, so it's quick. Can you use standing stones? Yeah, I'm using standing stone on calm. I feel like calm would only work on a lower level. Maybe on wolves, it would be kind of nice. For hunting too. 
Yeah, that's actually not a bad idea. We'll check if the court wizard in Falk Wreath has a calm spell. Traveling in the reek, city of Markar. Where do you want to go? Climb and back, and we'll be off. Couldn't ask for better weather. Coruscant, thank you so much for the tier one. There once was a hero named Ragnar the Red who came riding to right run from all Rory. I appreciate that, Joker Gibby. Thank you for watching. Thank you for enjoying the nonsense. How do you keep your energy up while recording slash streaming? Tried recording today, but felt super low energy. Um, I don't know. I mean, I enjoy it for the most part. Chat certainly helps a lot. Like, when something really, really stupid happens, or I don't, I don't know. Like, there will be lulls and boring periods as we go through it, and that's just a part of the type of game it is. And the type of way that we play the game and engage with the game. We played in a very slow but with chaotic moments in between way. But I don't know. I just try to make as much fun as I can with whatever nonsense is happening. Court wizard? Do they have a court wizard in here? Protect the Yarl, whoever that might be. Yeah, you're not the guy I need. Oh, there's an enchanting table outside their room. You. I'm the steward here. No. I serve under Yarl Sidgear and Yarl Dengear before him. What the hell, Nenya? You're like my favorite singer with one extra letter. Wait, I know you. Until next time. <laughs> Wait, I know you. You're the guy I've seen in my dreams. They don't have a court wizard. All right, we'll keep tabs on it and maybe try to get a calm spell. That could be really useful. Let's get these other ones favorited. I do like Oak Flesh a little bit more. After our last playthrough, can't cast it. I knew it. How much is it? 88? All right, I, I can cast it if I sleep. I think this might make the build a tiny bit better. Could I block things to protect myself? Sure. It's not that I'm anti-block. I, li I just like being a little bit more active. I think it makes it a bit more fun. Am I a 99 left balloons enjoy? I, I got no clue what that is. That sounds like 1940s German technology. Ah, oh, you're back. So, how went your first real contract? A bit more exciting than what Nazir's been offering, I'd wager? The options you have in the Dark Brotherhood range from, eh, you know, just kind of did the job to complete ass kissing. <laughs> I live only to serve. Hail, Sithis. And then edgy remain silent boy. Like, I feel like remain silent always has like a hair flip. Like, tch. very well. <laughs> I respect your discretion. My hair's not long enough to can't flip it. With a matter of a more mm, personal nature. Uh oh. Are you hitting on me, Astrid? What's going on here? It's Cicero. Ever since he arrived, his behavior's been well. Erratic would be an understatement. I do believe he is truly mad, but it's worse than that. He's taken to locking himself in the Night Mother's chamber and talking to someone in hushed but frantic tones. Who is he speaking with? What are they planning? I fear treachery. Like, look, there it is again. By sit this, we must stop them. <laughs> so that's so funny. So you understand my fear. If Cicero's planning something and conspiring with one of our own, it sounds like RuneScape dialogue. Disastrous. Why I? Why I never? Dear brother, I need you to steal into that chamber and eat. It'll be no use clean like inside the Night Mother's coffin. Yes, the coffin. Mm. Ooh, we get to get real close with the Night Mother. All right. About time. <laughs> That's what I signed up for. Their right mind would hide inside. Now go before they meet 
and report back to me with whatever you learn. Quest complete. That's what I'm talking about. Three points on the board and we get to lay in the same coffin as a dead old lady. What a reward. Go quickly. Hide in the coffin. Okay, all right, all right, I'm going. I'll hurry up. Wait a minute, this wasn't here before. This does feel wrong. Um, <clears throat> excuse, oh. oh. Who sees me? alone yes <laughs> yes alone <laughs> sweet solitude no one will hear us disturb us everything is going according to plan the others is it that hushed tone astrid was talking about coming around i know it the wizard festus crex <laughs> Perhaps even the Argonian and the Unchild. What about you? Have you... Have you spoken to anyone? No? No, of course not. I do the talking, the stalking, the seeing, and the saying. And what do you do? Nothing! Not... Not that I'm angry. No, never. Cicero understands. <laughs> oh, yeah, it probably smells like shit in this thing. Always understands. And obeys. You will talk when you're ready, won't you? Won't you? Sweet night, mother. Poor Cicero. Dear Cicero. Such a hum. But he will never hear my voice, for he is not the listener. Oh, but how can I defend you? How can I exert your will if you will not speak to anyone? Boy, she's talking to me right now? No, but I will speak. I will speak to you, for you are the one. That's right. All that bear trap, bear trap, all that bear trap, espionage and ass kissing. Oh, warms my ancient bones. I give you this task. Journey to Wallen Road. Speak with Armand Mortier. Poor Cicero has failed you. Poor Cicero. Really, Wallen Road again? Sorry, sweet mother. Tried so very hard, but I just can't find the listener. Tell Cicero the time has come. Tell him the words he has been waiting for all these years. Darkness rises when silence dies. What? Uh. What treachery? <laughs> I come out with like lipstick all over my face. <laughs> no, that's not what it looks like. Explain yourself. Speak, worm. Hey, hey, hey. Don't be mad that she likes me more than you, Cicero, okay? She spoke to you? More treachery. More trickery and deceit. You lie. The Night Mother speaks only to the listener! And there is no listener! What's his foot doing? Wait, you see that? You see his foot? Well, uh, look at that. Wait! Hold on, Cicero. She said to tell you, 
Darkness rises when silence dies. Silence being you and darkness being my penis. No, <laughs> no, no, I did not make the joke. I didn't make it. I didn't make the joke. those words to you. Darkness rises when silence dies. But those are the words, the binding words written in the keeping Enough. Tones. So no more no night mother sexy jokes, all right? We're moving on. Sweet Cicero. Then it's true. She's back. Our lady is back. She has chosen a listener. <laughs> she has chosen you. <laughs> Why me? Why sit this? This ends now. Back away, fool. Whatever you've been planning is over. Are you on? Wait, I heard the commotion. Who was Cicero talking to? Where's the accomplice? Reveal yourself, traitor. I spoke only to the night mother. I spoke to the night mother, but she didn't speak to me. Oh, no. She spoke only to him, to the listener. What? The listener? What are you going on about? What is this lunacy? That's right, Astrid. I'm your superior now. It's true. It's true. The night mother has spoken. The silence has been broken. The listener has been chosen. When I heard Cicero screaming, I knew you'd been discovered. I feared. It took you like five minutes to get here. We were talking for quite a while. I, I, I don't know. It, it all happened so fast. <laughs> okay. I didn't know. Let's all take a deep breath. Cicero said he spoke to the Night Mother, but she spoke to you. Please tell me this is some kind of sick joke. It's true. The Night Mother spoke to me. She said I was the one. Nah, seriously. Like, I, I know. I, I don't want to keep making jokes about the Night Mother being attracted to my character in some way, but, like, come on. What? So Cicero wasn't talking to anyone else. Just the Night Mother's body. Yeah, no, Cicero's just weird. The night Mother, who, according to everything... Not, nothing know, devious is going on. He's just a strange guy. His listener just spoke. Right now. To you? By Sithis. And? What did she say? I'm going to speak to someone named Amon Motier in I've done Volenrude a million times. I have but Volenrude, that I have heard of. And I know where it is. I do too. Hmm. No. No. Listen, I don't know what's going on here, but you take your orders from me. Are we clear on that? No. The Night Mother may have spoken to you, but I am still the leader of this family. I will not have my authority so easily dismissed. Of course you will. This is Skyrim. Come on, I'm the main I character. Time to think about all this. Go see Nazir. Do some work for him. I'll find you when I'm ready to discuss the matter further. What? I know where Volenrude is. I know how to clear it. This is all just I've done it like a million times. Go get some work from Nazir. Still here. What's the matter? Thank you, kind sir. Still catching up on yesterday's stream. Have fun with the challenge. Your first target is an Young Gizik, thank you very much for the eight months. No problem. Catch up. This one will this one will be a while. Happy hunting. I have not done enough of the main quest to get any of the shouts. Happy hunting. Wait, Lurbuck? Some of these characters are characters that I have killed before outside of this quest line. Okay, Morthal. Half Moon Mill. Where are they at from here? Oh, Half Moon Mill. Really close. Morthal, just straight north. I'm trying to think of the most efficient way we can go about this. What if we went, what if we went Hearn at Half Moon Mill, Bleak Falls Barrow, hit Whiterun, 
Get the dragon stone, unlock dragon shouting, fight the dragon. North to Morthal. We could do that all in like one day, I think. We sleep here. Boom. Boom. Where do we go? We go here. Boom. 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 Broom. Got to sleep real quick. We need some gambling. If there are any mods in chat that would like to let you all gamble. I got to focus on my objective, though. Yeah, let's keep Oklash out. It's our weight. Ooh, we still we have like 50 pounds of free weight. So I do want to collect some iron ore. We spent quite a lot of it. And I think there's going to be enough room here at some point for another nice little crafting run. Tapanala. Ah, uh, we, we are going to have to do alchemy. That's one thing that I'm short on. Because healing potions certainly got me through that last dungeon we did. Thank you. Come here. Wonderful. Look at that. Boom. Already at half moon mill. No, my bear trap, it's gone. Now <laughs> my best weapon. Well now, what have we here? I'm being attacked. No, no, <laughs> I didn't mean to chicken. Are you a witness? Yeah, we can't have that. I'm not taking a 1,000 bounty back to Falkreath. Nope. That actually worked, though. It got rid of my bounty. Alteration and sneak XP. Why did Hearn go flying, though? Let's check their hut. Got 19 days left. We're almost at... Oh, no. I do not need a cast iron pot. That'd be nice, though. Hide. Nice. Oh, I, how am I accidentally taking so much useless shit? Not much else, really. Save the salt piles. That was an awesome assassination. He went really far.
Butterflies, three of them. Come on. Again, this is just more Bosmer hate. Where'd the third one go? Oh. Lady Stone, regenerate health and stamina more quickly? I'm gonna take it. I think the stamina regen is gonna be really, really nice. Since we're playing with Blade and Blunt balancing, it's already really good. Stamina is just super important. It feels like we've been live longer than we have because we've actually gotten quite a bit done today. Oops. Why are you... Why are you attacking me? Who does that? Thank you, kind sir. Who's being nice? How's he? Thank you for 10 months. Appreciate that. Hope you're having a good day. How's everybody Saturday going? It's the weekend. What are y'all up to? Anybody gaming? Lots of new games lately. Honestly, all the games that have been coming out lately are like the perfect type of game to like play with something on the second monitor. Be careful. I don't know what I'm being careful of, but I'll trust you. I'm playing Elden Ring. That's not very calm. That requires like full focus. Solo honor mode. Oh, I uh, so I don't know. Honor mode is. Oh wait, solo honor mode. Isn't that permadeath? But I have on my uh, on my Series S, which the performance of BG3 on Series S is hilarious. Like the cutscenes are all significantly worse quality. It's low res. It's. I mean, it still looks fine. You know, like I can enjoy the game for sure. Um, but I do have a save that I played a little bit of solo and the last I played if anybody who's played BG3 Do you remember the spiders that are underneath the first goblin village you go through? Like the very first initial ambush you do That's where I got stuck that fight is really really hard but the solo character, their class is a uh, ranger. I believe ranger. Because I wanted to have the summons. Nulvis? Is that a Wabajak mod pack? All right, for those who are unfamiliar, I'm about to teach you a cool little new path of getting up to Bleak Falls Barrow. I think. Unless JK's Skyrim moves these rocks around a little bit or any of the mods change it. Must have missed it. There we go. Now we're here. Oh, nice shot.
I'm actually in trouble. I completely forgot about healing potions. Nope, nope, that is an orcish warhammer that somehow missed me and I'm alive. Oh, these bandits are tough. Oh, close. Bring it on. That orc is just going to kill me in one hit. No, why does he not stumble again? Ah, oh, damn it. I went for two in a row and I cost myself. Oh, he missed. Oh, he missed. Oh, my goodness. How am I alive? That was very stressful, but that was fun as hell. Jeez. Can you not make it so stressful next time, please? I just want an easy dungeon. I know, I, I should buy a lottery ticket. No idea how that hit. That should have killed me. I always forget that there is either a delay or if you go for two stumbles in a row, it just is not going to go well. But that's big. We saved five hours. But now, part of me thinks, do we go Riverwood, potions? We push through. I guess I have my healing. I can only really cast it one time in a fight, and certainly not after I cast Oak Flesh. Oak Flesh saved us as, the, uh, as well. Oak Flesh was a great investment. Ah, oh, nice shot. Fuck. Separate. Other side of the room. Let's freaking go. Let's. I'm, I'm pumped. I know I'm not doing a good job of showing it right now because I am under an immense amount of pressure. Uh, but hell yeah. I'm starting to feel it. We're getting a little bit more powerful. We got another level up. Let's burn just an hour. Magicka could be nice. I'm starting to use Magicka a little bit more. Let's take it. Let's go one more point in Magicka. Very small one. And there might be a good idea for us to either go cheaper alteration or make fast heal a little bit cheaper or I keep my damage up. Or I buff my armor as well. I don't know what to do here. We have a lot of different places we can go. Double down on bear traps. I don't think we can go bear traps again. <clears throat> but yeah, having an extra cast in the middle of battle is gonna be huge. I'm gonna take alteration because we have transmute let's make transmute a little bit cheaper as well spider's gonna be a problem i'd love to take that potion i'd love to 
take that one. By all means, please. One, two, two. Honestly, I think I could, like, novelize, if that makes any sense at all, this dungeon. Not now, or I could, like, sit there and basically just explain the entire layout of the dungeon without being in the dungeon. We've done Bleak Falls so many times. Healing potion? I didn't craft it. Yeah, we gotta craft them. Alright, this is not gonna be easy. We have to cheese it. We gotta bring him over into the corner. But even then... I think they can still hit us. Yeah. Yucky. I gotta stay at full health. Get it away from me. Get it away. Whew. Keep it away from me. Come on. Nope, got me. Not as much damage as I would have thought. Still, I don't want to risk it. We just have to play it safe here. I can either lose an extra 30 minutes of Skyrim time by being patient and smart, or five hours by getting myself killed. I forgot that I had Oak Flush on. That's why it wasn't doing that much damage. Sorry, Arvel, I just don't have the patience today. That was really close, but damn, he got swatted. Both of them. That almost got me. All right, got our first soul gem. This sucks. I need that first conjuration skill point now. Am 
I kicking ass? Am I playing well? I think this is the first time the whole run I played decent. What was my plan here? Yeah. Come on, gentlemen. Bring it over here. Come for your weekly ass kicking. He's gonna power attack. Oh, you went for it. Oh, where do you get off thinking that ice is okay? I would have deserved dying there if I got killed by the swinging <laughs> by the axes. Oh, Ooh. settle down. I got to settle down a little bit. I'm getting too excited. I'm feeling too confident. This is always when things go terribly wrong for me. I'm sorry. I just can't the dopamine right now of so many skill increases, kills me not dying. It's going to my head a little bit. I'm starting to really feel Mac. I'm feeling like Max Cable. It all comes back to Max. I'm feeling good. I'm doing what I want. I am in charge. Whew, they still hit really hard, even with Oak Flesh on. This is an awkward arena. <gasps> Dip, see? That's where I get myself killed. That's where I get into trouble. Ruby, that's big time. We've got a couple ore veins in here we can hit as well. Yeah, <laughs> shall not. Sorry, my bad, my bad. I keep forgetting. A 20 year old reference? Try 23 year old reference. You know what I didn't know? I was doing some research last night. The guy who played uh, Max Keeble also played the main character in Home Alone 3. They're not active in Hollywood anymore. But I just found that curious. It's like, damn, could you imagine the residuals of being in a Home Alone movie? I, I feel like Home Alone 3 probably still gets run. Alduin would be Troy McGinty. Definitely. Amethyst. I'm really enjoying all the gems we're finding. I think this is going to pay dividends. The fact that we're saving all of our iron ore, we're kind of treating iron ore as currency to be converted. It's kind of like a cryptocurrency, right? For every iron ore we have, if we hold it in our, <laughs> if, we, if we keep our iron ore in our crypto wallet, it will transmute eventually into silver coin. But then if we hold it again, it will compound transmute twice into gold coin. Nice try. A little bit of lockpick. A 
another amethyst, another soul gem, another level up. I can't. Whew. I'm loving this. Loving this right now. It was really, really rough. Those first, you know, six or seven hours, real tough. This fight's sneaky difficult, though. I always try to get really cute on this fight. Instead, let's just be safe. I was expecting a second dragger on the floor. Ah, no, I didn't oak flush first. That's what happens. Very close call. And that was just a tier one Draugr. He caught me off guard though. I saw the archer as soon as he snuck out. He was sitting right here to jump me. Which is weird. I've never seen Draugr strategize like that. What the hell is going on? I wish I was better with hotkeys. Uh, this one is 222. think that's right expert skyrim player go back and sleep before this battle yeah but then we waste time do you know how many skyrim minutes i lose in that i lose too many our damage went up a little bit it's up to 23 throw that on quickly so we at least have a heal during the fight Get fucked. Get absolutely destroyed. Completely embarrassed. Bleak Falls Barrow, don't even try anymore. Ah, Andy, good call. I always forget the chests in here. Wait, three? I thought it was just two. They might have somewhat okay loot because I'm level 12. No? I am gonna go, I am, I'm gonna, blah, blah, blah. I'm gonna decide against using scrolls, by the way. I know we discussed it the other day. But we're gonna ditch the scrolls. Another amethyst. Is that cheating? Is taking an ingot like that cheating? I haven't taken any ingots that same way. So we'll ditch it. It's not, if, if it was auriculum ore, I would be okay with taking it. But it's, it's already processed. You know what I mean? This opens up over here, okay. 
Wait a minute. We're gonna cheat here. This is I, this is a much faster route to White Run. Cleaned my whole room, house, and did all my laundry to this stream. Thanks for keeping me sane. Hell yeah, that's what we like to hear. Be productive. Never mind. I was gonna try and go through Bleak Falls Barrow because on the opposite side of that approach, when you go up the snowy hill, there's a slope that goes right down into a giant camp right outside White Run. So I was gonna try and take that route. Instead, we'll flip it. We'll hit Riverwood. Nice, we got through the whole thing without using any potions. We needed that. I'm still super uneasy about actually fighting Alduin. I don't, maybe we get to the point where we're strong enough. Might be a better idea to just go for, yeah. If we go for Thane, how many points is Thanehood, five? I would put it to 12. That means we can get a vendor. We can unlock the blacksmith. We have 18 days or at least a few trips to make use of their inventory. Thane is three. Okay. So yeah, let's go for Thane. That gets us to 10. If I knew perfectly where all the quests were going to take me, I would do like a vendor in the most optimal cities. Good opportunity here. Wherever those wolves are. Three of them. Yeah, I think we need to take that first Conjuration perk. If we're able to Soul Trap a little bit, we can do some enchanting. I don't know if the enchanting will be enough to really change the game, though. It could. I mean, it could very closely. It could flip a very close battle. The Riverwood Trader is... Uh, yes, an ornament. Thank you, you kind you, sir. 400? Where it belongs. I'll, I'll never Joker, give me thank you so much for the prime. Great thing for me and my sister. Also, Cyber Psycho Bunny, thank you for the 100 bits. Just started watching your vids on YouTube. Top tier follow for. I appreciate that. Thank you for watching. I, I'm looking forward to the next time we do follow for. We haven't in a while. I just have so many damn, like... I different like Skyrim challenges that I've wanted to do or that like we kind of have on this list Come on in. and it's like which ones do I want to do the most which ones am I most excited about uh, let's wait on that you know what let's wait let's not burn all of our potion ingredients yet thank you so much for people around who aren't seen by the fire and I'll send someone over. You're that visitor, Ben. P sure thing. It's yours for a day. I mean, I do generally like it more, Rise. Um, Whatever for me, that's just like personal preference. I really like the... I don't know, I feel like... I, I, I like the... close sort of... Uh, it's really hard to describe. It's like a closer slowed down I like melee combat I like fantasy action if that makes any sense I like magic and swords and bows and arrows um, but I do quite enjoy Fallout 4's first person shooting
I'm going to go back into stamina. A little bit more carry weight. We're going to need it. Let's go conjuration. I wanted you to have this. Oh, Lucan's trying to give me a gift. I'm sorry. What is it? Thank you so much for taking care of those thieves. Riverwood. I got no clue what he gave me, but uh, it was it was a very nice gesture. I gotta fix my posture. I think my green screen, just like the angle that I have it at, it's kind of fucking up how much space I have and gets me all messed up. No, I've never tried the VR version. I need to. How many pickles can you eat in a row? Two. Before it starts to be a little bit too much, two. I do love pickles though. Anything dill. Dill pickle, uh, there's these, what brand is it? There's a brand of these, like, I've gotten them at Subway before. Spicy dill chips. Oh. You talk about the perfect potato chip. Insane. You know what I did one time was. What do you want? I've been I'm telling I'm talking about potato chips. Move it along. Looks like that's it. Got to go. When I was in high school and I played baseball, I used to always mix the salt and vinegar uh, seeds with the dill pickle seeds. Killer combo. Like a couple months ago, I had a bag of dill pickled lays and then salt and vinegar lays. Combined them. Insane combo. I gotta check the time. I feel like we did that really efficiently. A lot of load screens, a lot of places we went through. We had 18.7 left. Not quite at the halfway point. So I feel like we're about to start really moving quickly in terms of power. Unless you've got cold sores or a cut in your mouth. Absolutely. They'll do some damage. Yarl, Yarl, wizard. Wait, which one? Are you, which? Well, who am I supposed to talk to again? It seems this damnable conflict has claimed everyone's ah, passion. Ah, okay. Uh, Yarl, Yarl, I come bearing news from. Uh, is it Riverwood? Oh, yeah, Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes. By Ismir, Irileth was right. What do you say now, Provences? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to... It's in the most immediate danger. If that dragon is lurking in the mountain... The Earl of Valkyrie, will you... Enough! 
I'll not stand idly by while a dragon burns my heart. Hold and slaughters my people. Irileth, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my yards. If you'll excuse me, that would be best. Here. Elven. Oh, I can't use it. No. I got so excited for elven armor. Like, yes, an upgrade. No, I can't use it. Can I at least just see what it would look like with this? I just want to see the drip. Uh, it definitely works with everything besides the hood. That's actually a nice look. A little bit of red. The gloves and whatnot. A little bit of red on the boots as well. Yeah, that's decent. I like that. Rate my drip. Oh, that's too loud. Come to dragons. I think I found someone who can help you. Well, when I say straight to the, I uh, go to Bleak Falls Barrow. Ah, the Dragon Stone of Bleak Falls. That. Be All right, sweet. Let's get some XP here. The only enchantment I have is Fortify Alchemy. That's it. Created potions are one percent more powerful. I guess I can wear my really expensive necklace now. How and jewelry. Was it seen? Well, what was it doing? Uh, take this a bit more seriously. Two levels? If a dragon decides to attack white one, Hold on, question. Y'all, if I enchant jewelry that's super expensive, does the price of that jewelry make me get more XP? Or is it just the power of the enchantment? It's the price. It's kind of hilarious. Okay, that's why I leveled up twice wearing this nec uh, necklace. All right, we got a 2% buff to our alchemy. Hell yeah. What if we just accidentally f stumble into the enchanting alchemy loop? I've already ordered my men. Good. Don't fail. What's the hurry? The hurry? What do you mean the hurry? That we have 19 days until the end of the world. But I haven't ask and please accept this gift from my personal armory. I should come along. I would very much like to Yes. No. Yes. We're cooking. All right, disenchant. Now we're up to 28. Resist frost could end up actually being pretty solid. Right, think about it. Having resist frost in our back pocket, depending on what we want to fight and where we want to go. If we had 50, 60% resist frost. Hold on, this is a dragon encounter. I'd rather not die. All right, she's gonna go. We'll meet her when we meet her. I envy you the chance to see this dragon up close. Wanted to get that extra level. I'm gonna go take a quick nap before the... Oh, yeah, you're right. Calm spell. Thank you, chat. Calm, calm, calm.
Got like a million different things going on. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongo. Take a look. This is going to be decent, at, at least as like a defensive tool against wolves. Because we've gotten rock joint how many times? Five? Six times? That might be a stretch, but we've gotten it a lot of times. I don't want to exploit it, but I think we are going to go get some salmon row. We're here. We're, we're right by white run. Although, wait, hold on. I don't know, though. Because what that's going to do is, you know, the enemies will scale a little bit. I'm not going to take that many alchemy perks. I'm not going to take any of the combat perks for alchemy. It's just going to level us up. And it, we could we could hurt ourselves doing that. That does feel cowardly. Saber cats are levels. How the hell are saber cats level six? That seems very low for how powerful they are. If it's work you need, sure thing, it's your I'll show you to your room right this way. Need anything else? Just let me know. So this right here, where we're at with this character, I would consider this the mid-game. And I think that with the current mod setup that I have, this sort of power level that we have, I think this is when it's the most fun. It's a little bit rough at the start. New enchantments are 20% stronger. Soul gems provide two extra weapon charge points per level of enchanting. We'll take it. I'm just going to pray and hope that we get a really solid weapon enchantment from the Axe of Whiterun. I think it's just damage stamina, but that could also help us. Stamina, I think, is incentivized a lot more with Blade and Blunt. What did you think of the Indiana Jones challenge? I haven't uh, seen it. Oh, Baron Zaya, you just downloaded Apocalypse? Please do. It's a great mod. And, you know, the wild thing about that video, if if you take out all the Conjuration spells, because functionally they're all very similar, there are some utility spells in the Apocalypse Conjuration tree and, you know, a couple in the vanilla game. But if you take out, you know, con the Conjure type stuff, we only covered, you know, 45 spells in that video. There's a lot of Conjuration ones, and there's probably another 80 pretty usable spells that I didn't get to. A few meme spells in there, but definitely it's a great mod. I think if you're going to use it the first time, you should just pick a school of magic and just stick to one or maybe two. I don't want Soul Trap from the Axe of White Run. I want fire damage if I can. Fire damage would be pr pretty straightforward. It's a blanket buff. You know, unless I'm fighting a dark elf, I don't think there's very many things that have resistance to it. This is my favorite. I, l I love this rule set. It's so rough at first. The, the intro beginning stages of Iron Man are super rough. But it's so satisfying. I love it. I don't know, I'm having a decent time. I'm enjoying it. What elf power? That works on Mammoths? I don't know why that surprised me. It doesn't when I say it out loud. Have you checked out Shadow of Skyrim? Yes, we have used Shadow of Skyrim uh, before on the channel. I should not be confidently approaching this dragon. He's going to kill me. I, there's no way I can eat any of the dragon's hits, right? I mean, I'm going to try. <laughs> I'm going to try to.
I don't know how that missed. He somehow turned and just fired right into the wall. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I can't eat that. I thought there was going to be a guard out there. Out of the way, please. Main character here. Whew. This is not the greatest idea, though, because if I have to manually travel across the map, we're going to get jumped by dragons. That is chaotic and fun, though. For the second half of this challenge, having dragons on the map is fun. You can't defeat me. Not in a mod, Wandy. You can put Pokemon in this game if you wanted to. I'm pretty sure Pokemon is in this game. It can't be sold. Like, you can't make the nemesis, which is stupid. It's fucking dumb. Fuck Warner Brothers for that, by the way. There's so many sick games that could use some form of the nemesis system, and they're just like, no, we're gonna, we're gonna patent it and never use it again. Like, go fuck yourself. That's so dumb. Dude, it's like a toddler who's not playing with his toy, but then when somebody picks up their toy, they're like, what? What? I, I want to play with the fire truck. Well, that's my fire truck. That was risky. For no reason, that was risky. Flawless Garnet. We'd love to see it. Sadly, I'm not going to take the dragon bones or dragon scales. God, I want to. But they're just too heavy. All right, let's suck up the dragon's soul. Get in here. Slurp it on up. Eat some potato soup while inhaling dragon soul. I know, Mollus, that was dumb. I shouldn't have gone through my healing potions there. I, in fact, will not be using my dragon shouts. Not that I'm anti-dragon shout. I just think the... What, did we use them in the first Iron Man? Thank you, kind sir. I don't think the dragon shouts are boring, actually. I think they add a nice... You know, it's just like an extra ability. And like, even if some of them are kind of memes and kind of out of whack, there's still like some random utility to quite a lot of them. It's like a lot of the goofy spells with Apocalypse. And I think it's cool, you know, that just like, you're just straight up using dragon language to like mess people up or send them flying. Like, what is it? If, if two dragons are in the sky fighting each other, they're technically just shouting at it. They're like having a shouting match together. We're looking for someone in White Rock. We'll pay good money for information. We will find her eventually. I work with my mother. Sell fruits and vegetables. Yeah, like, Whirlwind Sprint's pretty cool. If you think about it, like, I complain a lot about dual wield, and I say, nah, there's not that many movement options for a dual wield build. Like, you're too compromised. I feel like you could combo Whirlwind Sprint with dual wield and actually have some pretty killer movement. I've just never really tried it. It would take a while. Like, I'm used to playing with one-handed weapons and two-handed weapons and switching back and forth between magic with my hotkeys and whatnot. But that could be really fun. Finally here. The all's been waiting. So what happened at the watchtower? I knew I could count on 
Dragonborn. So it's true. The Greybeards really were summoning you. Ten points, baby. Masters. Now here's a weird part. Which vendor are we gonna take? High on the slopes of the throat of the world. The drag. If you, you heard the summons. What else could it mean? I don't really even have that much to sell. I would only buy. Uh, ooh. Did you hear the thundering sound as you returned to White Run? That was the voice of the Greybeards summoning you to High Rothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Blacksmith seems like the obvious one, but maybe we do go with the general store for soul gems. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable as he may be, I don't see any signs of him being this yeah. dragonborn. But I think we just have to go with Belathor seems basic. Why, you puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the first empire. But we'll get rarer. Won't we get rarer uh uh, crafting materials from a blacksmith. It's just that what do these graybeards want with him? Belathor is so icky. You're right. Forget the challenge. Belathor would sell his sister. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something in you, and the graybeards heard it. If they think you're dragonborn, who are we to us? The Khajiit traitors. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually an awesome idea. No refusing the summons of the Greybeards. Oh man, that's a great idea. I don't know if I can stomach it though. Investing Oh, for this challenge, investing in a merchant just means we unlock their services. Since throughout the challenge, the only thing we've been able to buy are spells. Disconnected from you've done it by my I'll also we are no matter. All right, Axe of White Run. Stamina. Yeah, we got stamina. That did not give me any XP. What is that nonsense? That's a ripoff. All good. It's all good. The Jarl has What's up, Lydia? No, nah, it's all good. What do you mean nah. Now, nah, what did you follow me outside? No. Stay inside. There are your orders. All right, we get one free crime in town. How should we use our new Thane ability? I'm the Thane. I am the Thane. I am the Thane of White Run fame. You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure. Why is that not an option? <gasps> I thought I could get away. But I'm the Thane. I am actually, I, I might, genuinely, this might be the first time this meme has ever made sense, but I, I, I am never going to financially recover from this. Seven days in jail, absolutely can't do it. Smart man. Now come along with us. We'll take any stolen goods and you'll be free to go. That was worth it. Fine. Fuck, I'm scared. That was worth it. Whatever. A thousand gold? Pfft, who cares? I got the money to cover it. I'll get 42 of it back. What if it just goes into Kai's pocket? Uh, it'd be easy to get one point really quickly by just joining the companions. Let's do that. I'm gonna join the companions just to get one point off the board. A stranger. 
Would you? Mm. Yes, perhaps. A certain strength of spirit. All right, let's move this along, gentlemen. Master, you're not truly considering <coughs> accepting him. I am nobody's master, Vilkas. And last I checked, we had some empty beds in your master for those with a fire burning in their hearts. Why don't I just get a crazy case of hiccups? But perhaps this isn't the time. I've never even heard of this. Garak Blaze, thank you for the prime. Sometimes the famous come to us. Sometimes I got hiccups right now. Come to us to seek their fame. It makes them. what matters is their heart and their arm. Of course. How are you in battle? That may be so. This is Vilkas. He will test your arm. Vilkas, take him out to the yard and see what he can do. I. Oh man, Vilkas, you are so like really. My sword is still covered in blood. I just the. The dragon? Right outside of town. What are you giving me that look for? I actually fought the dragon this time, kinda. Isn't there a chest in the guard barracks with your gold? Hey, watch it. I think only when you go to jail, right? man said to have a look at you so let's do this just have a few swings at me so I can see your form don't worry I can take it there you go. not that next time won't you might here's my sword go take it up to Yorland to have it sharp and be careful it's probably worth I'm gonna just stop talking until my hiccups go away what brings you here? I'm guessing you're the newcomer then. Oh, don't worry. And don't always just do what you're... Well, Kodlak is the harbinger. And I have a favor to ask. I've been... My wife is in mourning and I need to get... That's a good man. Where the hell is Ayla? Wrong quest. Hold your breath for 10 seconds. to hunt with ah good i've been waiting for this are you new here yep i told you this is the whelp that vilkas mentioned i don't let vilkas catch you saying that what's Do the you hurry think you could handle vilkas in a real here let's have farkas show you where you'll be resting your head all right come on let's go what the hell did you call me of course we did ice brain show i just kind of realized i held my breath in there for a while New blood. Oh, hello. I'm Farkas. Come, follow me. Alright, I gotta be honest, chat. I'm running a little bit low on energy. Even though I'm really, really enjoying this challenge. And like, I want to keep playing. Genuinely. Nice I want to keep grinding this. Cool. Also, I want to have all the f like footage done, I hope we keep you. just so that we can start actually making the project. All right. So here you are. Looks like the others are eager to meet you. Come to me or Ayala if you're looking for work. Once you've made a bit of a name for you. Done. By the way, if you're looking for something, there's always some sort of trouble. It's a problem with the four swarm. Excellent. Show them no mercy. Up to eleven. We're probably at 13 days past now, or no, maybe not. No. We got the whole dragon arc and all that. We got that done in about 0.4. It's going to be interesting in post to look at this and be like, which sections of the game we completed in how many in-game days. It's going to be very interesting to look at 
you know, that last section of Dark Brotherhood stuff. That quest was pretty tough. We had some penalties. So how many days did it cost us in general to do? And I think for first vendor that I get, uh, we're going to get to 20 points. We're going to get to 20 points. I'm going to go with the blacksmith. It's my, it's a gut feeling for the first vendor we use. I'm going to unlock Adrian. I don't claim to be the best looking to protect yourself or deal some damage. We're going to use our 10 point checkpoint. Oh, Yorland? Why Yorland over Adrian? Craft more bear traps? We can only hold two at a time. There's a limit. Yeah, but I won't be crafting with steel. We've gone past steel. And Adrian is right by the front gate. Like, Adrian has convenience. She's right by the front. It's going to save us some time every time we come to town. We're going to go with Adrian. Gut feeling. She has enchanted gear in here. Is it cheating to buy? I feel like it feels a little iffy to buy enchanted gear and disenchant it. Although it is really expensive and getting gold is still manual. Like we're not getting gold. I guess I could also sell to her. Maybe we'll think about that. Yeah, we definitely can't use the gear we buy. Thank you, kind sir. Yeah, like 1,200 gold? Damn. 1,700 for a helmet? But like this dagger, 600 to unlock burning and fire damage? I would take it. She's unlocked. Yeah, we're going to let it. We're going to let it go. It'll it'll unlock a little bit of enchanting for us. That does, in my opinion, though, it takes away a little bit of the awesomeness of a good enchantment dropping from uh, from a quest. She does have Moonstone. She doesn't have a lot of Moonstone, but she she has it. We're going to go with Adrienne as our Don't forget to check inside first vendor. I'm going to save up here. At the end of day two, we are 12.63 days in. Technically 12.1. We added an extra half day at the end. We have 18.36 days remaining. I'm going to assume that day three of this stream will be like of this series will be really chaotic. Should be a lot of stuff going on. A lot of new goals. A lot of stuff to do. Uh, this one was really, really fun. Thank it was kind of by the book, so, but we did make a lot of good Buying progress. Enchanted gear should be allowed. It's already expensive enough. I'm, I agree, Jacob, because like at the end of it, we're going to be able to buy. What, two, three enchantments, maybe it was either we buy the enchantments there or I buy filled soul gems. I was going to buy filled soul gems. So this I don't get the soul gems, but I do get some more enchantments. I still have to manually find the soul gems. Uh, Jag, thank you very much for the prime. Hargrave, thank you for three months. Dark, thank you for the prime. 
Uh, let's see. Who's streaming Skyrim today on a Saturday? Let's send the stream over to somebody playing Skyrim right now. 12 hour stream. That's crazy. That's a bit wild. They're six hours in. They just hit the halfway point, and it looks like they're doing. Oh, this is a good one. Okay, I'm going to send you guys over here. They're doing crowd control on Skyrim right now. Serenity of the Moon. So hang around for a little bit. We'll raid out over there. Appreciate it, everybody. Have a wonderful rest of your weekend. Hopefully I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, remember to be respectful when you're in someone else's stream. You know, don't try not to overwhelm them too much. Be kind, be supportive, all of that. Don't backseat like crazy. I'm sure they've played Skyrim before. That's all. Talk soon. Appreciate y'all.